In, in your wickedness, you have broken the ancient commandments and crafted a bond with one of the light. Our laws are clear. They demand you be eternally imprisoned. As for the impure child, she must be kept from the path of the dark arts forever. The impure child. That's our MC, right? That's cool. Oh my god! Yes! Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to Bayonetta! We are finally playing Bayonetta for the very first freaking time. I'm excited, and if you are, Hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel because it's here. We're playing the game. Okay, so let's see. I love this whole UI and menu. It's awesome. Right, so vibration camera seems okay. Sound settings okay. Display settings. We're going to leave it, I think. I guess I guess we play then. What's what's in the extra content? Gallery Umbran Tears of Blood. I don't know what that is. Maybe you guys can tell me in the comment section what that is. Here it is, Bayonetta. First time playing it. I'm so excited because I'm a huge Devil May Cry fan and it just makes sense for me to play this game. I don't know how I haven't. I don't know before I add, I have no idea, but I'm finally playing it. And here we go. Difficulty, we're gonna leave it at normal. In a universe of light and dark where perception is reality. Moon, I see the moon. Right, so who have we got here? Who who are these two characters? There's the MC there is the girl. I, I'm assuming her name is Bayonetta. Long since Bro erased from the records. Okay, time, I can okay, okay we're getting straight into this. Okay, so circle seems to be Oh my god, it's just like the MC. The Umbra Witches. Dwellers of the darkness and the luminous control. These combos are sick. The clans hate each other greatly. All right, computer, relax. To maintain the balance between them, defended the just passage of time. Yet one day, that balance was toppled. Dude, I love the way we do roundhouse kicks for days. And I love the fact that it, it just threw me into the game. Is that a dragon? And stoked the flames of hatred. With, with no tutorial whatsoever. It's just like, here, have at it. No help bar. Just figure shit out. The conflict between the Umbra and the Luna threw all of Europe into a chaotic loop of battle, ambush, assassination, and casualty. It was truly a gruesome war. Despite the tremendous Bro. radiance of God shining upon them, the Lumen Sages were gradually weakened by the assault of the secretive Dark Witches. Years after the balance was lost, the war had ended in the Umbra Witches' favor. The Umbra Witches? Is that who we are? Are we a witch? Dude, this is like classic... Devil May Cry style combat, and Their I'm all here for it. Was I'm literally all here for it. The witch's dark Look at that freaking dragon, dude! Began to the I obviously can't keep getting hit like this in the, the actual game. With little resistance and subjugating those who wish to continue the struggle. Human faith in the miracles of their god pushed the witch hunts further, and soon the Umbra witches Keepers of the darkness were extinguished from the earth. Dude, I want to listen to the lore so bad, but I'm kind of distracted. Let's go! Just stay close to me! 
Whoa, 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 whoa. Bro, this is nuts! Present day. Buffalo of blood. That was... That was badass. They literally threw me right into the action. Okay. Is that... Is that the other girl? Blood. Lot, lots, lots of blood. Are they all getting assassinated? Like... It's cool how everything is displayed on, like, film. Okay, so here we are with the prologue. The vestibule. Graveyard, what a great way to start. Okay. Developed by Team Little Angels. Oh, I love that. This is cool. Cinematics director, Yuji Shimura. Producer, Yusuke Hashimoto. And director, Hideki... Kamiya. It looks like Humpty Dumpty's taking his last fall. Even Oleg Man the Destroyer gets scrambled in the end, right? You know, I still don't get why the hell you drag me out here for these things. I just drop off the merchandise. Hey, bet you can't guess what today is. Reading the good lord's book ain't gonna do much. People been waiting for this asshole to get whacked for ages. Please. Now, look around. There's no love lost for old Humpty Dumpty. But you gotta keep the outfit happy. We don't take care of him, they take care of us. And I prefer my shoes made out of rubber, not concrete. But hey, it's that kind of town. Without good-hearted souls like us to put these bastards six feet under, where'd society be? Of course, the pay's not bad either. He talks a lot. Can't you tell? Like, she's trying to concentrate, Jesus, bro? You really get into this shit, don't you? If it were me, I'd be praying he ends up barbecue. Or at least sunny side up. <laughs> You can keep praying, but the only way this guy's meeting the Lord is if God's hungry for breakfast. <laughs> Speaking of hungry, we done here. My kids are baking me a birthday cake tonight. Cute little fuckers, I tell you what. You've got kids? Well then, adios. What's happening? What the fuck? They're here? For this douchebag? I guess I would have to kind of put like some sort of disclaimer. I can't see a thing. The language and stuff, it's Yeah, there's no filters. You hear me? You you can see them, can't you? I see them. They are instruments of God descending upon his heavenly rays to earth. Oh my god. Dear Lord, grant us guidance and keep safe the souls of our loved ones for all eternity. Whoa. Oh. 
Whoa, this is nuts. Third sphere, affinity. I was just about to say, is she about to kick their asses? Yep. In the most goddessy way. You look tired. Let me tuck you in. So are they are they like fallen angels or or, or what? Like Dumb it Oh Oh excuse me, who is, is that? The freak? Next time you want your hands on you, you better make sure I'm dead. Now move out the way. He's got a hard head, holy. Bro, 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 bro Rodan? If it ain't my good buddy Enzo, how about you get out of here? You die, and I'm gonna have to go back in that hole chasing after the money you owe me. Do you naughty little angels deserve a good banking? She is. Oh my god! She just German suplexed all of them! Oh. Um, what just happened? Excuse me? What was that scene, bro? <laughs> I was not expecting that. <laughs> what? The sounds. Holy crap, dude. This game does not hold back. The music as well. Whoa, whoa, whoa. She puts the gun on her... On her heels? Is it possible to fall in love with a video game character in less than a few minutes? I need a drink. Cheers to Bayonetta. What is this game?
Dante, I think I found your wife, bro. Holy crap. <laughs> Woo. Okay, uh, we're, we're, we're officially playing this. This game is amazing already. All right, okay, we're actually getting a tutorial. For a quick punch, press triangle. Beautiful. For a powerful kick, press circle. Yeah, we were doing that at the start. Oh, combos! Combine circle and triangle to unleash combos. Oh, that's sick! Or evade with R2. Whoa, that's awesome! Dude, in the slow mo and shit. Woo! Gotta get the timing of that right as well. Ah! What a finish! Alright, so R2 is to dodge. Right, what's next? Which time? Dodge it at the last possible instant to activate what? Which time? Enemies will appear to move in slow motion for a set period of time. Oh my god, dude, this game! A very rare spiritual metal containing the essence of Angel's life force. Used in business transactions within Inferno. I'm guessing Inferno is the name of the shop. Oh, that's so cool, bro. Oh my god, this is amazing. I love this game. Already. Oh my god. Dude, she's so hot. Why is she so hot, bro? Now I know why people are so hyped for being at a three. Oh, this is so awesome. Oh my god. This game's incredible. What what the hell are those things? Ooh, halos. Alright, shoot your enemy shoot your way out of Wait wait wait. Hold. Okay, didn't know that was a thing. Look at this girl's strut. My god, you rocket girl. She deserves to be on a catwalk. Rotate and press O to fire all around. No way! Yeah, let's give it a go. Oh, wait. This way. Wait, which one? Oh, wait. Wait, what? Once activated, aim and fire with... Excuse... Bro, that's actually insane! There is so many... There is so much potential for combos in this game. Holy crap, bro. D dare I say, the gunslinging in this is better than Devil May Cry. Holy shit. And that was one of my favorite things in Devil May Cry, but it was usually just auto-aim stuff. This is actually so cool. It is, in a sense, auto-aim, but... It's really well done! Oh my god, let's do this shit! Oh, you get all the angles, bro! You get all the angles! Oh my god, I'm Sonic collecting rings! Hey, 
So are they angels of death then? Is that what- Hey! Bring me back my fat guy! Hey! Uh, oh! Is that, it, is that your car? Oh shit. Oh. <laughs> Haven't you figured it out yet? There's no quarter for you in this world. Oh my god, the combat is so good! Oh god, is this guy like a boss or something? He's like a mini boss. Yes! Alright, I only got a silver medal. Dude! I love how everything about this just reminds me of Devil May Cry. idea how much this is gonna cost to fix how the fuck do i always get wrapped up in this shit ed and edna Ooh. engine still purrs nicely now about this little thing you've been looking into for me enzo let's have a quick chat see this is why i told you i was going home i just got held up in the air by some invisible things and you want an intelligence briefing it never stops with you you keep belly aching like that and you're liable to wake eggman from the dead eggman and i don't think either of you would like that oh. catch you later bayonetta something tells me you see what you did there on our special project before the shit hits the fan wait rodan what about eggman such a popular chap I bet they hate him down there as much as you did when he was up here. We just need to make sure he won't come crawling back when they kick him out. Nothing a flower bed can't fix. Fill her up. You heard the man. Finish up in five minutes or you're walking home to your cake and candles. What? Don't you leave me here! <laughs> oh man! Oh no, loading screens. PS5, lads. PS5. Oh, what a day! I'm screwed. Ah! Oh, it's gonna take every cent I earned on this charade to pay for the damage. I tell you what, if I can see them bastards that did this to my car, forget about it. Forget so, about it. <laughs> I love that. So calm. You're still getting screwed in all this too. Of all the low-life scum in too deep in this town, I've never seen one get wrapped up in a fight with God's messengers. Oh my god, did the steering wheel come off? <laughs> Jesus, imagine actually that happening to you. Like, oh my god. end up in the afterlife, that's not going to be pretty. I can't help it if I like the little outfits. The toys are nice, too. <laughs> 20 years ago, you woke up stuck in a casket at the bottom of a lake. All you can remember is that you're a witch. But now, you're stuck. Right. Because you got to sacrifice our halo-wearing friends every day, or they'll drag your ass back down to hell. So she has no recollection of her previous life. But being forced to slap around the divine for a living? That's really getting screwed. If I needed a biographer, you wouldn't be my first choice. I see to the funeral. You get me the information I asked for. That was our deal. Ha 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 ha! Come on now! Look at my poor car! I'm working for free after this! At least let me get a drink at Rodan's before you start drilling me. The info I got is good. 
It's gonna get you close to finding the other stone in the pair, and figuring out some of that lost past of yours. I swear. Flashback. <laughs> After jewels instead of cash. Just like a girl. <laughs> Jesus. Can't you take a joke? Enzo. Someone's given you a present. Hey, too bad. I can't stand bugs. Oh. There's a tracker on him. Is that who's following them? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh shit. Well, you're definitely not going to get that car fixed. What the hell? What well, what about Enzo? Oh, it's her friend, right? Oh wait, she probably doesn't remember her. Oh my god, we're the same. Okay. What was that? Finisher or something? Whoa, what's this? Umbran Tears of Blood? I'm a bit of a mean witch. It seems. What? Uh oh. Okay. We're running out of time, bro! Yes! Yes! Nice! Got a gold medal for that one, too. Woo-woo! Man, I missed the good old classic button bashing in these games, bro. It's, it's just so good. This game is so feckin' stylish, I love it. We got female Dante and Virgil right here, and it's amazing. Do you know what? Fuck that. These characters are their own thing. They're amazing. I love it. I absolutely love it. I'm I'm still like completely and utterly shocked that I haven't played this game. It is everything that I loved in games when I was younger and now. The gates of hell. Oh my god, dude. Those assholes sure know how to get attention. Even perk the ears of the hotheads down home. You don't say. 
It's getting harder and harder to tell the worlds apart. Human world. Inferno. Paradiso. Who can tell the difference? Human world. Inferno and Paradiso. Purgatorio in the middle. Fight long enough in there and you'll really lose sight. Why the sudden interest in metaphysics? It's a balance, right? Even if some of them like messing around with the humans, we've all got a stake in the status quo. But people keep fucking around like this, the Book of Revelations is gonna look like Mother Goose. Heaven and Hell are gonna go straight for each other's throats. Heaven and hell can tear each other to pieces for all I care. I've got my own problems to worry about. Something's up. Everything was a bit too brazen. And Enzo's tip makes the timing too perfect. This reeks of a setup. Someone in one of those lost memories calling you out. Whoa, look at this arsenal. A little present for you. These babies are special. Built from an alloy the devil himself would kill to get his hands on. Don't break these, because they're one of a kind. New guns. Oh, shit. Yeah, she, she liked that. Let's say Scarborough Fair. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude! There is so much inspiration from the Devil May Cry series. It's unbelievable. What an elegant and feminine twist. It's amazing. It's so seductive. It's hot. It's sexy. It's action packed. It's stylish. It's everything. You're calling me out. I don't go in for strange offers. Jesus, are those pistols or revolvers or what the freak are they? they keep throwing at me. Maybe I should aim for something a bit more high class. Pounding them down tonight, baby. Not to butt into your affairs, but I'm pretty sure you got somewhere better to be. The guys you're up against aren't the type to wait for you to finish a round. She's gone. <laughs> Yo. Enzo, her drinks are going on your tab, buddy. You did beat motherfucker. <laughs> Hey, I got a gold award, eh? That's not bad, right? It's a good start. I'll take that. Ladies and gentlemen, it's what you've been waiting for. Angel attack! What? Another tutorial. Wait, what? How to play angel attack. Aim and fire on the angel targets to rack up a high score in this thrilling shooting game. Boy, did, did I use up all my bullets? Shite. The Angels of Metropolis. I actually love the overall layout of this game's UI and the game's menus. It's done really well, it's super stylish, and it really fits the theme. So, I asked around and some whale in Europe is trying to fence a huge rock on the black market. He calls it the right eye, saying it's part of some set called the eyes of the world. Fits the bill of what you're after, don't it? Now, Here's the funny bit. The stone passes around the halls of power for hundreds of years, vanishes, and then the black market goes white hot for the thing. But the seller wanted an arm and a leg for it, to the point no one could stomach the price. So back goes the stone. But not before everyone figures out where the guy is. <laughs> You're gonna enjoy doing this one, I bet. I love sticking it to the rich. Of course, when you do, don't forget your old buddy Enzo stuck his neck out on this one. Slide me a few fuzzles out of the rich guy's pocket for my troubles, right? Anyways, you better get going before the trail gets cold. 
off to the middle of nowhere. Paradise of Europe. Ah, oh, there's Ireland! I see Ireland! Yeah, represent! Wait, well, that dude is covered in black. I'm assuming the NPCs are just blacked out or something, or? <laughs> Here we go! She is hot! Oh, wait a minute, what? Who's that? Here, Mom, my dear child, such a beautiful young lady you pick out. I have always seen to it no harm comes to you. So, this is supposed to be paradise? Central station platform. Look at the way she stands, dude. <laughs> that cannot be good for her back. And then the struts. Oh my god! This character! <laughs> wow. <laughs> She's hot, bro. She's so hot. We can double jump already, which is great. Oh my god, I'm heavy. Dude, uh, the, the amount of com combos that we have at our disposal already is amazing. All right, so where are we off to exactly? Through here, maybe? Yeah, it seems like we have to go this way. Oh, so looks like the subway's closed. Wait, what's this about? A resident of Vigrid. Maybe a part of the religious doc doctrine, but everyone is wearing holy vestments. As long as I am in the... Purgatorio, I won't be able to intervene in their affairs. But that also means that I should be able to get around this place without their interference either. So that's where we are. The pur Purgatorio, which is this world between worlds. Ooh, what's this? The sphere embedded in the wall is emitted a wondrous light and resonant sound. Getting closer to it makes it glow brighter. It's as if it has some sort of ability to respond to which is power built in. So we just bash it? Damn! Let's go! All to extend your jump duration and again to double jump. Yeah, we've already figured that out. Bro, I could watch your walk all day. There's a hole in this iron door for something to be inserted in. Alright, we need a key. Do we need to jump down then? Oh wait, what's that? Mandragora root. Okay. Looks like we can head down anyway. Okay, let's see if there's anything down here. What's this? An object bearing the seal of the sun. Upon the ped pedestal, there's an engraved headstone marketing resting place of a witch. There we go, we got something. Oh, she actually puts it on her back! <laughs> That's cool! Uh oh, it's showtime. Wait, I'm using the key as a weapon? I was not expecting this. Holy crap. It shocked me a little bit. I wasn't expecting it to actually work as a weapon. And for such a short period of time as well. Because we're using the key now and it's gone. I got pure platinum. Nice. Okay. Voyage towards the truth. I've been a journalist now for over 20 years. I'm always aiming for the guiding light of truth. Always pushing forward. I believe that communicating the truth is the core tenet of all journalism. Chasing it until my legs turn to rubber. And the truth is burned into my retinas. 
Wait, who who wrote that? Oh, dude, this game is blowing my mind. Oh my god, is this a shop? Oh no, it is set of two crystal statues, but one is in pieces. It has been destroyed in an unnatural manner, as if in a fit of rage powered by deeply held grudge. Wait, what? Wicked Weave. What? Wicked Weave technique uses your hair as a conduit to summon four demonic entities? All right, I guess. Oh, shit. Oh, yes. Yeah! Woo! Gah! No damage! Platinum medal! Let's feckin' go! Baked Gecko! Yep, I mean, that would probably happen to me if she blew a kiss at me as well. What is this? Lumen Sage and Umber Witch. When their powers meet in the test of strength, the lightning released will be your test. If you wish to walk upon the water, pure, pure, pure. Let's try that again. If you wish to walk upon water, prove your mettle by dodging the lightning in since in a single hair's breath. Do dodge? You mean like like dodge like that? All right, well, it looks like we're able to walk underwater. Oh, lift. What? Lumen Sage. Oh, when their powers meet and test. Okay, let's, let's try that again. So we need to dodge. There you go. Did I do it? I did it, didn't I? Did I, did I do it? Was, was that not it? Did I? Nope. <laughs> Three, two, one. Shit! An art that. Oh my god! Whoa! Okay, that was literally like the last millisecond. I got a green laurel, a laurel-shaped gem that contains vital essence in crystallized form. Revives one's vitality instantly when obtained. That's amazing! Whoa. Now we got a platform. Dude, this game is so cool! A lift powered by magic. Humans wouldn't would be able to power this device. They're probably completely unaware of the ruins that lie beneath their feet. Wow. Let's try walk through one of them. Oh yeah, they actually feel it. That's so cool. Dude, I love the overall aesthetic of this game. We're done? This town's teeming with heaven's little helpers. It's making my buddies downstairs awfully nervous. And your point is? Some places in this world are closer to Paradiso or Inferno. The rat hole of a town you and I live in is close to both. But the Vigridians, they got a special air about them. They're closer to Paradiso than anyone should ever be. And that shit just plain creeps me out. <laughs> I guess I'm gonna have to set up shop here and score me some halos. These stupid rings are worth a fortune back home. Since it seems you're spoiling for a fight, if you come across any of these, bring them to me, and I'll hook you up. Well, you know Sega's behind this anyway. We got rings, we got an Eggman. <laughs> I'm beginning to see why Enzo is so fond of you. Real cute. But let's get one thing straight. Your fights are yours alone. I'm only here to watch my handiwork in action. 
So don't get any bright ideas about coming to me for help. No. You get one thing straight. I'm not the slightest bit interested in the fact that you made these guns. If you get in my way, I will... How do the Americans put it? Oh, yes. Bust a cap in your ass. <laughs> right on, baby. Right on. <laughs> Right, okay, Radon is some sort of, like, demonic entity or something. Bro, that's nuts. Do we go on this? Enter the gates of hell? Oh, he's from, he's from hell, okay. Let's look, have a look around here first. There's a book over here. Central Station. Crystal Witch and Sage. The Crystal Witch and Sage. Within Vigrid City, there are a great many structures built long ago by the two clans, the Umbra Witches and the Lumen Sages. Amongst them, all have sun and moon duality, evidence of a peculiar outlook towards the universe. The Witches representing the moon, and the Sages representing the sun, burned into the fabric of the city in various ways. One of these structures, a pair of statues crafted from a high-quality crystal known as the Bellaston, Crystallus featured both the witch and a sage. The statues appeared to hold some sort of special significance. According to the ancient records, they were created to aid in the training of the art of overseeing time, a skill only the two clans were capable of practicing that also served as the key to locking something away from public view. Should the clans feel the need for secrecy? However, the exact details of this art are unknown. Now the city, scarred by the tragic witch hunts of hunts of the past, has seen many of the statues depicting witches destroyed or heavily defaced. Even these beautiful crystal statues were unable to escape the calam cal calamish calamitious calamitious fighting. I'm not really sure how to pronounce that word. So we got Umbra witches, and we got oh shit! I wasn't supposed to do that. There were. Oh, damn, there was something there. Okay. Uh, so we got Umbra Witches and we got Sages. Here we go. What? Yeah, what? What's happening? Uh oh. It's go time, baby. Third sphere. Applaud, Archangelus. All right. Let's do it. Shit, what is this? Oh my god, what is that? Second sphere of beloved. Oh, all right. It's okay, we got this. I'll pick this up. Hey! 
Get off me! Damn! He's got some whack to him. Oh, there's his weak spot. Nice, I found it. Climax, mate. Oh, my God. What the fuck? Oh. Go. Oh. I only got a silver there. I am... What? Oh! What the... F I am... I am actually flabbergasted by this character. Trois Marche Militaires. A golden LP featuring the crystallized voices of angels. Some sort of silhouette is drawn upon the surface. Oh my god, dude. This character is incredible. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> this weapon's ridiculous. Okay. Can really mix it up then. Wait, what? Oh shit, that's the attire I was wearing what at the start. Let's go. Oh, we got a little bit of a flashback that we're playing. Oh, okay. What? Okay, it looks like we're, we're, we're actually going to fight. Oh shit. Uh oh. Oh shit, he's really strong. What the fuck? Oh shit, I wasn't ready for that. Oh god. This is. Whoa. What is this? Whoa! Not bad. Whoa! Oof. Uh oh 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 -hoo -hoo -hoo. oh my god dude yes dude I wonder when we're actually gonna fight that boss for real okay that was awesome dude just everything about this game is incredible and I love it. Oh my god, this game is so old as well, dude. It's amazing. Oh, we didn't do great. Ugh. I've discovered the existence of something called alchemy. It is the de de deconstruction combination and reconstruction of everything. Metal, flesh, even spirit. If one understands the logic of the age, alchemy is a prime example of the era in which it was developed. Although lesser known... Is the fact that alchemy is an offshoot of witch's secret art of concoction. Concoction was only practiced by the Umbra Witch clan, and the materials, amounts, and methods used were never shared outside of the clan's inner circle. However, 
In the chaos of the witch hunt, some details were said to have slipped out, including knowledge of the primary mixing compounds, baked gecko, unicorn horn, and madragorora root. I think I have those things. So we can actually make brews to help us. Like, here's like recipes, concoctions. Right, okay. I'll need to, um... I'll need to do something about that. Wait. What? Oh, oh shit, okay. Alright then, you dickhead. Oh, damn! <laughs> the poses! <laughs> Holy crap! Oh, okay, you're, you, you want some more? Oh, damn! What is happening? Whoa, did I just die? Okay. He's coming back this way anyway. It seems. Yep. All right, dickhead. Whoa, what the freak? She's shaking that booty, bro! <laughs> Eat up! Yes! Yeah! This game making me so goddamn thirsty. That was amazing. Holy crap. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Woo. Time for more angel attack. Oh shit. Not doing so good here. Headshot! Yay! I got 25 points. Not bad, but not great. Alright, in the last episode, we actually defeated a giant beastie. Speaking of giant beasties, wait! Is that a motorbike? A motorbike of demons. Oh, it's her. I'll say it once and I'll say it again. This is heavily inspired by Devil May Cry. And I believe a lot of the talent behind Devil May Cry is also behind this game, so... I can see that. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure motorbikes can't do that, but okay. Who needs physics in video games? Fancy bumping into you here. Out to find some answers about your past, are we? You've quite the familiar face. And using the same powers. 
But you'll have to forgive me. Do we know each other? You sure do. <laughs> Same powers. <laughs> Don't make me laugh. Your little dip in that lake has left you a bit rusty. Oh. I've been high and dry for 20 years now. The only rust on me is from the lack of any real challenge. Perhaps you're up for the task. You've already disappointed me. What's that? Oh, that's hers. Yeah, that was on her chest. Oh, she got it. How? How, how did she pull that off? How? This is a moment I've long desired. But you've forgotten your destiny. And wasted the past 20 years. You're right. I do seem to be having trouble remembering things of late. Would you be so kind as to take it from the top? Two overseers. The eyes of the world. They are the power behind everything. Two overseers. Jean, as heir to the clan, the time has come for you to prove your right to fight under the Umbra name. Jean. You may select opponents of your choice. Then allow me to face the outcast. Why is Bayonetta the outcast? The child is of impure blood. Challenging her would be a violation of our tenets of faith. It would not be the first time we faced each other. Kiard? Will you face me in this hallowed arena? Well, if I must. But I pray you've got a little something for me in return. You know, I'm very fond of stuffed animals. She likes plushies. <laughs> oh, or actually, okay. Wait, when the moon shines bright in the sky, face the wall and press X to which one? No way. Oh my God. Oh my god, this is Oh, this is so trippy. I, I'm not sure where she is. This is making me nauseous. <laughs> what the freak? Jean! Oh, there you are. Come at me. You taunting me. Whoa! This is... Oh my god, which walk is so cool? Like, I know... I knew... I can't speak. I'm... <laughs> Dude. <laughs> I love it when games do this to me, bro. <laughs> I literally can't do my job. Commentate, DB. Commentate, for feck's sake. Oh my god, it was so cool! I want to do that fight again. I think that fight is actually really good training to do like the witch time and stuff. Major flashback, dude. She remembers now. Watch this now, look. 
Oh my god! <laughs> oh. Okay, that's a different angel head. Third sphere. Deer and decorations. Angels. So a lot of you guys have been telling me that this is... Has a lot of... Has a lot of um, accurate depictions of angels, demons, and all that sort of lore. I, that makes me very interested because obviously I, I am a lore lover and I'd like to explore that a little bit more. So if there's any like outside source material that expands this, this lore and this information a little bit more, let me know. Oh, they're dead. Good night! Yes! This game, it feels good to play, bro. <laughs> it feels so good to play. Oh my god. I cannot believe I've missed out all these years of Bayonetta. And you know what? It's a good thing. I get to play this for the first time. I bet you're jealous. I bet you're jealous. It's funny because when I was younger and I played through the DMC series, I've always been craving for that experience again. And there was no sequels for a long time. And all this time, there was this. Blows me away, bro. Also, another thing to note that a lot of you guys have been mentioning in the comment section of my previous video is that I should have played this on the Nintendo Switch. Which I understand, but I wanted it to play on the PlayStation for th for two reasons. One of those reasons, of course, is performance and uh, you know the lack of loading screens and just uh, the sheer power of the system being able to run this game in the best possible way, the best possible frame rates and resolution. But the second reason is because of nostalgia. Now I say that because I played the Devil May Cry series all on the PlayStation. Uh, that's all I knew. Uh, it was PlayStation 2, I believe, is when I played Devil May Cry 1, uh, Devil May Cry 2, and even Devil May Cry 3. It's just that that feeling of playing it on PlayStation again, a game similar to Devil May Cry. That's the reason why I'm playing it on the PlayStation. Now, that being said, I have downloaded that strut, baby. I have been downloading the, the dual pack, I think, that's on the Switch right now, so... I'm going to try it out on the Switch and maybe practice on the Switch. And then when we go forward with Bayonetta 2 and then, of course, Bayonetta 3, it'll be on the Nintendo Switch because it is a Nintendo exclusive now. We got another one of these birds. All right. Missed them. Get back here, bird. All right. A book here. An unknown metal wall. Within Old Vigrid, many ancient stone structures have been preserved, being developed further as they are repaired, lending the town a peculiar sense of the historic. Modern architecture has also taken hold in Vigrid, starting with the central station. However, it is all to give form to the sacred institutions of the ancient sages. The architecture gives us a glimpse into the people's deep sense of respect for their past. This town of old and new still keeps within the bounds its several strange things that the modern man struggles to make heads or tails of. For instance, dark green barriers made of as yet unknown metals seem to block certain alleyways. Their shape, comprised of many complex bricks, impedes one from proceeding down the ancient paths of the city as though they were rejected visitor. Though it seems these paths saw everyday use in their distant past, I may claim this material is as yet unknown, but in reality I haven't a clue regarding its composition. It is harder and heavier than anything human being is capable of moving. Or so I have surmised from examining its chilly surface. I wonder why these lost witches and sages scattered these walls around the city. It seems that the, this, these paths and stuff are only accessible by witches. It's to keep the humans at bay, isn't it? Even a short examination of this wall shows there isn't a way through it. Perhaps if I were to unleash some temporal witch power on it my situation wouldn't would suddenly wait i didn't see these statues 
Ah. Uh, here we go. This is what we need to do. <laughs> I love how she just switches to bikini mode. There we go. Got it. All right. I'm getting used to this now. Ooh, what's down here? Oh, kitty cat! Hello, cat. Hello. Do you sense me? Can you see me? Who's playing stray? I'm not. I need to get to that. Oh, I don't know why I wrecked that. Okay. Car! Oh, please. Oh. Okay. Um, I thought I was able to drive it. Shit. Cutscene. Wait, is this another new character? It's like Assassin's Creed. Okay, I, I wasn't expecting it to go this direction. Do you believe in fate? Fate brought us here together, and it will never tear us apart. <laughs> Who is this guy? He's got a grapple hook? Fuck! Where'd that bugger go? <laughs> Alright, so we got a new character here. Sayonara. Fleur de cire eau de parfum. Such a wonderful floral bouquet. With its subtle hints of rosemary. Wait, he can smell me? You know, in the language of flowers, rosemary equates to remembrance. <laughs> Which doesn't quite equate to you, now does it? Bayonetta. So, wait a minute, he knows me. He planted the bug. You, you, my little I'm not your pet. The name is Luca. Luca. Okay. The name you better remember. <laughs> Whoa. You can't just run away from me like that! I know what I saw that day! Well, another flashback? I love this, dude! Oh, look, little Luca! You got the same scarf! Wait a minute. Oh, he was there when Bayonetta was found. Oh no. I know all about your kind. She killed his General dad? My colleagues laugh at me for chasing fairy tales. Amongst other things. But I know they're real. I know the truth. Uh oh. Showtime. The smell. the same smell that clung to the air the day my father was murdered. Which means I'm right on your doorstep, Bayonetta. I'll let you in on a little secret, Cheshire. The name is Luke. You need to hone your 
your sense of smell, my dear. There's no rosemary in the perfume. After all, rosemary is a demon repellent. Oh, here we go, baby! Oh, wasn't expecting that. Come on, then. Let's have it. I'm missing. I'm missing all my attacks. <laughs> Come on. Ow! Woo! Let's pick this up. I'll pick this up. What's this do? Oh, this is cool. Whoa! I'm missing though. <laughs> yeah! Good night. Who's next? I'll pick this up. I love when she does that. Oh my god! Oh, I'm in love. <laughs> you only run away so fast because you've got something to run from. Me! But you can't escape me forever. <laughs> She's right there. I feel like she can send something in him. He is special, that's for sure. He's still so young, though. Maybe she senses or feels a little bit of regret as well for killing uh, his dad. Okay, so we've been introduced to Luca. And uh, when Bayonetta was found by Luca's dad, uh, she killed him. I'm assuming it was completely unintentional, though. Uh-oh. What is that? Third sphere. Enchant. Whoa, bro! Nice. Not too bad. Got platinum all the same. Oh, what's happening now? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did you just call his big bro? What is this? So there's, there's two now? Okay, that's fine.
Whoa, he's grabbed me. Well, I wasn't expecting this. Get out of my face, bitch. I'm gonna hit you with your bro's hammer. Oh my god. He's so good at that. Oh my god! Stop with the grabbing! Get out of my face, bitch! Come on! Gotta get him with that witch time. It's the only way this is gonna work. Let's finish this! What? I... I think I just... Come on! Almost. Did I? Is she? Hang on a minute. I don't know why I didn't notice this before. Is that her hair? Whoa, hang on a minute. I think I just realized. Okay, we have Quasi Una Fantasia, a golden LP featuring the crystallized voices of angels. Some sort of silhouette is drawn upon the surface. Um, Is her entire outfit made out of her hair? Oh my god, hang on a minute. Why didn't I notice this before? Her clothes are made out of her hair. <laughs> what? That is... that. That's... Yeah, that's an interesting uh, character design right there. I'm... I'm all here for it. There we go. We got a little bit else. Right. That wasn't flawless by any means. Oh, okay. Oh, what's this? Broken moon pearl. A piece of moon pearl gathering two of these will increase the li limit of your magical power. Okay, cool. We never actually... So what I'm gonna do. I'm, I've never gone to the gates of hell yet. So let's do it. Oh, here we go. All right, okay. So this is actually the gates of hell. Oh yeah, because they said it there. Well, well. An angelic hymn's gold LP. Got your hands on something awfully rare, haven't you? That thing is the perfect bait to coax out some of hell's ugliness. One note hits their ears, and a damn who's who of Inferno comes pouring out of the inner circles. Then I can use them to breathe life into what I make best. Weapons of mass destruction. Tell you what, you give me that record, and I'll order up something so fiendish, angels will cry at the sight of it. I'll just have to pop down to the tropics for a bit. So take a load off. To the tropics? Right, so that LP that we found is obviously something that we can exchange for a new weapon or a new item. That was quick. All done. He's a little rude, but he makes up for it with charm. Be nice to him, okay? Onyx roses. Holy crap! You got another angelic LP, huh? Hand it over then. I'm in a good mood. So I'll take care of it right away. Okay. Where are you going now? Wait a minute. Dude, I didn't realize I had two. When did I get the other one? <laughs> this 
took a bit to pound into shape, but the workmanship's solid. Now, go put this thing to good use. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Shuraba? This symbol graces only the hottest of hot items in my shop. If you're not sure what to go after, look for a face you can trust. Yo, I have onyx roses, which are 69,800, which I can actually afford. There's other things coming soon. Rodin's treasures. I don't want to call them Rodin, it's Rodan, isn't it? Techniques. I can buy techniques. Air dodge. Stiletto. Dodge an enemy. Oh, this I need. This I need. Because I've tried to dodge midair a few times, knowing uh, I've never done that before, and realized uh, it's an actual thing. Green herbs and stuff. I don't actually have any health potions or anything. I'm going to get these. Right, now I'm broke. So, have I got Onyx Roses equipped now? Oh my god, look! I have the swords there. Do I? Oh, I do have them equipped. Oh my god, can I still do this though? Oh, she does that instead. Okay, we're gonna try it with the sword. Oh, this is gonna be so good. Oh. That sounded like little feet. Yep. It's, it's a kid. With a cat. <laughs> My scurrying little friend. Just a child? What are you doing running around Vigrid? You're certainly not dressed in your Sunday best. Oh, look at her. Why does she look like you? Oh god, I'm nearly dead. Oh god, what's happening? Oh! I'm dead. Oh! Jesus! I'm not doing so good now. I was doing better the first time around. Oh shit! Okay, which time? Oh, and I'm dead again. Same place the last time. Shit, okay. This is this is tough. But it's all good.
And I'm dead. Yes! They do it! Oh my god. Oh god. Did I get it in time? I wasn't expecting fucking... Quick time events. Yo! We launching bricks, bro! That was terrible. I know I could do that a lot better. What I do plan on doing if I'm not recording... I'd like to go back through some of these levels and redo them. Just for practice. Oh no, a stone award? That's shocking. Witch time. Love that. If I was your child, I'd be an awfully ugly witch, wouldn't I? Yours is a face only a mother could love, and one I could never forget. If only I could remember where from. Oh my god. No quarrel. You're in no position to decide that. Oh my god. See, my For here is her outfit. My ability to eliminate your kind. I figure your sacrifice would shut them up for a while. Okay, why is the whole place erupting? Is this on top of a volcano or something? Right, I guess we're trying to get out of here now. Oh. Right? Do not do not touch the, f the, f the f Wait a minute. Doesn't that mean there's enemies? Yep. And they're on fire. Of course they are. Hey, what the... Okay, looks like I can only beat them with witch time. Can use her weapons though. Uh, Guillotine. Hey. I can shoot them, though. That was terrible, because every time I hit them, I took damage. Didn't like that at all. I know next time, though. What the shit? Okay. She doesn't do the strut when she has the sword, but look at the way she holds the sword. Oh, my God. Oh my god! Lava! Oh my god! What? No! There's lava coming! Piss off! Okay, not supposed to get caught there.
Oh! Okay, we should be safe from the lava now. Yes, no damage. Let's go. Wait, I thought we were... I thought we were safe. Okay, we're safe. Okay, what is this? A new angel. Virtues. Fairness. Okay, this this thing fires. Ah! Not not cool. What's this? Ah! There you go! Oh my god! Oh! The finishers in this game is incredible. I'm gonna actually equip my new guns. Onyx Roses. I'm gonna try these out. Oh, we got half of an LP. Okay. Because I missed the strut. I missed the strut. Come on, look at the strut, baby. Look at her. Fantasia Impromptu. Okay. Okay. There's... There's lava. Oh, let's try that again. Oh, God, more lava. <laughs> Look at them running away. Oh, God, what? Every single time, I'm just completely gobsmacked. Well, I did not know I could grab. What? Oh, jeez. Oh, no way. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh, shit. What's happening? Did I die? I didn't get it, did I? No! This is the second time I wasn't prepared. Although, the first time I wasn't prepared, I think I actually got it, but barely. All right, let's go again. Come on, Bayonetta! Alright, this is it. Got it. Nice. Umbra witches, controllers of the dark power. The ways of their discipline were actually quite varied. Breathing, movement, medicine, and tactics were joined in the Middle Ages by training in the operation of heavy weapons, culminating in a curriculum whose total bre breath and intensity are hard to a certain. This training forged both the body and the soul, honing each witch into a vessel of capable of withstanding the rigors of the magical arts and allowing one to begin the interact uh, with other dwellers of the magic realm. This interaction with the world of spirits lies at the very core of magic. I have been able to gain no further solid information regarding the magical arts, as the witch clan has long since been annihilated and their memory forgotten. The, resist the residents of this town uh, detest them with all their hearts. To allude to their existence to quite, is quite the taboo. Yet the key to unlocking the witch's mystery still remains. In Vigrid, the man held up 
by Manny to be a paragon of the fate, continues to seek out any remaining witches. Are the witches once thought to be wiped from the earth still among us? If they are, how have they survived for this long? What do they know? And where on earth could they be hiding? Finally, I have obtained scraps of a document that appears to lay out another elementary principle of the magical arts. I am unable to decipher the writing on the document, but it seems to describe a martial arts technique known as Dodge Offset. I pray it will be used to someone, so I have included it within these notes. So wait, did I get that? I got Dodge Offset. Oh shit, another one. And another one. There's two. Ah, oh, God! <laughs> that was a bad start. You asshole! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god, this one's kicking my ass! Ah! Oh my god, this guy's an asshole! I can't see! Take that, dickhead! I'm nearly dead, dude. I almost had him! Oh! Dude, I almost had my finisher. Ah! 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 Got them. Yeah! Alright. Not too bad. Not great. But not bad. Now what? More lava! Whoa. Dude, I get like... Oh, it was like... I wasn't ready! Like, Charlie's Angels meets Underworld vibes from this character, bro. She's so elegant and sexy and hot and action-packed and badass and paranormal and supernatural and... Hot! Did I say hot? This is hot in here. I'm not talking about the lava. <laughs> right, where are we now? Okay. Ooh. I got another broken moon pearl. <gasps> Contains a source of within source of witch's magic. Power the power of the power. The power of the moon. Obtaining this increases the limit of your magical power. Yes! Oh! Oh, not this again. Got them. I think it's time I went to the depths of hell and actually got some health potions. We're at the catacombs. Shit. You really want to make a deal with the devil? <laughs> Relax. I'm just fucking with you. I'm gonna need some items. Okay. So, how do we use our items? Alright. We got our health back. Awesome. The magical arts of the Umbra. 
Their true significance is best understood in the context of how the Umbra were able to use this magic via direct contact with demons in Inferno. It is thought that these witches underwent strict training in order to master the various techniques. However, the truth is colored by the fact that the witches left people awestruck and were greatly revered. The true root of their power was none other than their ability to take unbelievable strong demon energy and, and bend it to their will using it freely. The witches' direct contact saw them reaching into the heart of Inferno's darkness and summoning the beasts that dwell there. Drawing out their incredible magic and destructive powers, the witches under contract with these demons were, were able to exercise powers far beyond any that could be obtained by mere mortals, to the extent that some may even term these powers as aggressive or brutal. It was thanks to these powers that the witches boasted such awesome force in battle. From the Vigridian religious perspective, those living in the human world find interaction with other realms to be incredibly difficult. Residents of Inferno also find it impossible to manifest themselves in the human world. This is why witches require some sort of catalyst to summon demons into the human world. Channeling the spirit via this medium, the catalyst most often used by witches was their hair. It is well accepted that hair had many uses in the magical arts. And the witches called this to use their own hair, the Wicked Weave. Oh, I love that. It was said to have been used not just to summon demons, but also to summon magical items as well as forming the witches' uniforms. M our hair! So there it is. Our hair is our garments. The Wicked Weave. You heard it first from Antonio. Look at this place, dude. The level design is incredible. I love it! There's an ancient portal-like object here. There may be even more evidence of the town ancient civilization created the catacombs below. Whoa. Right. The falling rocks took out that stone bridge. There is nothing but a sea of lava below. Right. And, um... Okay. Guess we're going back then. The portal's open! Light is flooding out of the gate. There seems to be a completely different environment on the other side. What? Did I die? Am I in heaven? Paradi Paradiso! Rodan spoke about Paradiso. Whoa. I've gotten pretty good at that. <laughs> wow. Even the way she pulls levers. <gasps> oh my god. Use? It's an hourglass. It seems like the strange hourglass is able to turn back the sands of time. What once broken is now whole again. I wonder if that power stays true in the other dimensions as well. So does that mean... Since we've pulled that... Ooh. Since we've pulled that... The platform that broke down on the other side... Where the lava is, is, is back? Never mind. <laughs> I'm confused. Do we bring this with us? Oh, look. So if I use this here, it'll bring back the bridge. This game, dude. This 
game is so well thought out. Oh, I see you little shits. No damage. Let's go. I got this, I got this, I got this. Oh! Yo! Jeez, I didn't think I made it. But I did. Platform and skills on point, baby. It's still going. It's still going. All right, we're good. We made it. What's happening? Where are we? We've got another book. In Vigrid's long, protracted history, there was once an enormous colosseum built facing the sea. It remains today largely intact. According to the record, the colosseum was used to not for martial contests or other games, but as an altar for the worship of one of the era's gods, a being known as Fortido. Even today, as the urban functions of the city move to the Isle del Sol, the Colosseum holds a special place in the religious beliefs of those who worship the Laguna, even though the winds of time have long since destroyed the road leading to the structure, forcing a treacherous passage through the cliffs. The stream of those making a pilgrimage to the Colosseum is endless. Hang on, do we see the Colosseum? Are we are we actually oh I think we're actually heading to the Colosseum. This is the Colosseum. Wow. Yes, chapter three done. I see that there's there's a lot of gaps still here. Uh here. You can see. Oh my god, another stone award? Damn. I need to replay these levels. There's obviously a lot of like, is there like secret passages and stuff? I'm not sure. Oh, we have a cutscene. Nice. There she is. You again. And here I thought I'd seen the last of you. Such a strange looking thing. It's like a cool dragon. Wait a minute. That's Fortito. That's the god. I'm sure you'll be more than hospitable to me this time around. So are we actually going to fight him here now, like properly, for real? <laughs> I'm sorry, I forgot to mention one of the reasons I hunt your kind. You're much too ugly not to put out of your misery. Oh my god! <laughs> 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 
Okay, yep, we're, we're fighting them for real this time. What the freak is going on? Whoa, 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 I didn't think I could fall off. Okay. Looks like we... How do we get back up? Um, excuse me? Okay. This is a game changer because I did not think I was going to be able to... Hey, that was my way up, you asshole! Oh. Oh, oh shit. Okay, let's use this. Okay, this is going to rebuild the platform, right? Oh, yes. Finally, I'm back up. Okay. Oh, no. Shit! Okay. Yep. This is... This is tough. Please don't knock the platform. Okay. I am almost dead, dude. I... Okay. Okay, this is not good. Okay. This is actually really tough. I was not expecting this fight to be this tough. Okay. Uh, item. How many of these have we got? Ooh. Okay, awesome. I, how many do I have? Okay, we're good. Yes! Oh! Oh! Yes! That was sick! Okay, back to the hourglass. Okay, where's the hourglass? Oh, stare, 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 see. I got it, I got it. Okay, I'm getting, I'm getting used to this fight now. Oh my god! The gameplay is so good in this game, dude. Oh, I don't like this. What are you doing? Where's the hourglass? Uh-oh. Oh my... Holy shit! I'm ready. I'm ready. The button bashing is incredible. Maximum power. We ripped his head off. To the depths of hell with you. Yeah, you like that, don't ya? Oh, he's he's not happy. Somebody is not. Somebody's not happy at all, bro. Hourglass, hourglass. We good, we good. Oh! Bro, it was way too quick. No way, what a badass. Let's go. And there goes the platform again. We're back up. 
Oh, shit. Didn't get it, didn't get it. Didn't want to have to use so many. But if you need it, you need it. There we go. Whoa, what the freak? Uh-oh, angry much? Let's get that platform back up. Yes! Oh! Ah! Maximum power. Okay. Damn it! I need to use another one! I'm not doing great. The fact that I needed to use so many potions. But it's fine. This is just a casual playthrough of the game. No need to be a sweaty tryhard. Oh! You dickhead! Oh, come on again! I just got the platform back, you ass! Yes, finally! Yes! Come on! Oh, Giga Tom! Rip his head off! Rip his head off! Okay. Alright. Everybody relax. Everybody chill. the two dragon heads now you're nothing you're nothing without your dragon heads nothing you hear me uh oh oh well there goes the coliseum She really wanted that lolly bottle. Oh shit, I was about to pick up my drink. Okay, now what? What the hell do I do here? Oh my god. Jesus. Dude, what the hell? How do we keep get this guy? Okay. Oh my god. We almost have him, dude. We almost have him. Oh my god, my health. Have I got anything? I think it's going to be assigned to direction buttons. I think it's going to be assigned... Okay, what, what does this do? Oh, shit. Damn it. Okay, I'm in. Oh! I'm just going to have to... I'm just going to have to try survive. I don't like it. 
Whoa! Shit! Where is he? Oh god! There he is. Don't get greedy. Oh! I got greedy! Oh my god! Did I do it? Let's go, girl! Oh my god! My heart is pounding! Look at her hair! What? Holy crap! My heart is beating out of my chest right now from the adrenaline. And from her. You know, you're not nearly so ugly when you're screaming. <laughs> Foretold? Explain yourself. Jubilee. Jubileus. Jubileus. Is that Jubilius? Oh my god, we did it. Yeah, I used way too many. I got a... Yeah. Oh, what a day. Damn it! Okay, so I didn't do great. I need a break. That was intense. Yay! Round over. 41. That's not bad, right? I'm gonna need to get more of these. Alright, we're on chapter 5. The Lost Holy Grounds. This is gonna get tough now. I know it is. It's already kind of tough. Like, this game's not easy by any means. I think if you're very new to this genre, this game is a lot to take in. Um, simply because the combat is obviously awesome. Combos are amazing. I mean, you can bash buttons and hope for the best, but you genuinely need to understand it a little bit in order to to truly get a grasp of it. Like, the witch time thing takes timing experience. So, yeah, it's it's not an easy game by any means. Yeah. The Sunrise and Crescent Valleys. Where the hell am I? I'd better have got frequent flyer miles for that flight. Umbran, training grounds ruins. Can we go in here? There is a powerful barrier here, but something on the other side is giving me a strange sense of deja vu. As you've been there before. Whoa, what? What is this? Okay, it's a duo. What's their name? Second Sphere, Grace and Glory. Alright, new enemies, it seems. 
Ow! There. Whooping my ass. Oh my god, this is gonna be epic. Oh! <laughs> Let's go! Oh my god! The combat is just constant, and I love it. Another piece of an LP. Get it. Bye. See ya. <laughs> Blast him. Is, what is that? My lipstick. Oh, for God's sake! Really? It's her lipstick? Wait, what? Is, what's he doing there? without lipstick but lipstick without a girl <laughs> most curious isn't it cheshire what's also most curious is how a child like you has kept afloat in this town the name is luca and don't you think it's a little strange to be worried about my well-being sure the festival of resurrection has peaked security the thing only happens once every 500 years can you blame them Besides, when you look as good as I do, security isn't a problem. But a killer like you, on the other hand, I'm sure you found a way. That little girl. I've seen her somewhere. What? Don't go freaking out on me. We both know you came here for something. But what you don't know is the closer you get, the harder it's going to be for you to get away from me and what you've done. You'll have to fess up to it all. <laughs> I can't wait for you to get your hands on whatever it is you're after. Let me guess. You want a cut? Well, if you're still alive by then, perhaps you can appeal to my... Generosity. Still alive. You may be standing right in front of me, but you're definitely not living in reality. Which is a shame. Because the truth is always going to be the truth. All I see when I look at you, the real you, is the truth. The truth is, you killed my father. I don't care who believes me. They can't reject the truth. The truth will set me free from your black stain on my life. The truth will allow me to expose you to the world. Then, I'll have won. And I'll do it without stooping to your level. Because I'm not a heartless witch like you. Whoa, whoa, what are you gonna do? Kill me in plain sight? Go ahead. It would only prove everything I've said about you. Well, that and sadden the hearts of a number of young ladies. Claire and Trish and Sylvia and Trish. Amy. Oh, you don't Is that want a Devil May Cry right? reference? Let me tell you, hell hath no fury. Oh. <laughs> Did he just squeeze where I think he squeezed? What the?
That's the sexiest way I've ever seen anybody save anybody's life. <laughs> Damn! She saved your life, bro. Oh, another one of these. Except it's... Oh, it's electrical now. It's, it's fearless. Oh! Okay! There's two! Of course there's two! Why wouldn't there be? Come on, then. Ah! Ah, I can't see! Oh my god! Okay, I'm gonna die here, bro. Oh! Oh, I'm dead, aren't I? No, I'm still alive. Some somehow I'm still alive. Okay, I killed one. Oh shit. Oh no! Oh, oh crap, I forgot I had that. Okay, that came in clutch. Got him. Okay, I forgot I even had that. But that, that is handy to have. I don't know if I wanted to use it there though. attack dickhead okay then don't now you will oh that's awesome oh god Whoa! What? Bro! Oh, come on! Well, the bad guys are gone. <gasps> yeah, that was awful. I got a bronze. Ugh. Heavenly Manipulators. The Umbra Witches, Sacred Crescent Valley, is said to contain enormous relics hearkening back to the valley's place as a training ground in the witches' supernatural magic arts. The long bridge that snakes between the cavernous ravines of the, of the valley stone circles hinting at celestial principle training chambers where death was wagered in hopes of polishing one's skills in life. All of these are depicted in the tattered records I have obtained. I know not if they ever truly existed. However, the magnificent appearance of the witch statue in the distance seems to indicate that the legend passed down through history are in fact real. Amongst these numerous artifacts, the most mysterious, those known as Heavenly Manipulators. I have already described how the Umbra Witches drew their power from the darkness and the Lumen Sages from the light. However, I have not mentioned how these powers were at the greatest during full moon or at the peak of the sun's ascent. The two groups created the Heavenly Manipulators to affect the movement of the moon and the sun, and these devices play the role in the clan's most important of ceremonial rites. If stories are to be believed, the clans could affect even the ways of the cosmos at will. The powers of the witch and sage were not common knowledge, although, as overseers of history, one could imagine that they must have had appropriately powerful abilities, making their ultimate destruction an even more ironic end.
Dude. I love these entries. You get real in-depth with the lore and the story of the witches. Wait, we switching it switching it to sunrise? Oh, that's the moon. A moonlight disc is visible through the crescent window. Was the moon's sudden appearance in the sky when the gears rotated just a coincidence? I don't think so. I think this is like a portal or something. Whoa! <laughs> this is so awesome! Where are we going? Let's do this. What enemies have we got? Oh shit, these boys again. What? Oh my god. I okay. Squish. Nice. Got him. Yes. Ooh. We got it, we got it. Oh, what are these? Like stingray things. Second sphere, harmony. Oh, the piano's kicking it! Ow! What the... Oh my! Okay, okay, okay. Okay, we good. Oh! Alright, there goes one of them. Right, got him. Okay, that was a tough fight. Jesus. Whenever they introduce new enemies, it's like I have to learn how to fight them. You're never going to get a first try, you know? So it's all good. We got another one of these. I think that's the other half, no? Okay, it's not, it's not the other half. I have three of these now. I just need one more now. Yeah, this game definitely has got a lot of replay value. I'm going to play it again. I'm going to play through a lot of these levels again off camera. Uh, what the hell? The wind is alive now? Just so I can master the combat as best as I can. And learn the enemy patterns as well. Ooh, down here. We have another one of Antonio's logs. Beginning in the 15th century, the whole of Europe has been swept by a madness. A tragic event unprecedented in the whole of human history. The witch hunts, as a result, the dark clan of Umbra witches were wiped from the pages of history forever. Working at the behest of the powers that be and making use of their ancient magical arts, the witches watched over the passage of time within the human world, or at least they did until suddenly being swept up in waves of persecution and finally crumbling away under the pressure of the people's harsh recriminations. The woman's sorrowful blood Stained tears crystallized into bright red gemstones, and according to Vigridian, legend are said to be scattered how everywhere. These stones, filled with their feelings of regret, are known as Umbran Tears of Blood. To this day, the people of Vigrid believe 
that should have 100 of these stones be brought together as one. Enormous calamity shall befall the land, yet no one has actually seen one of these gemstones. The ultimate of witchly souvenirs, they must be found for you by a crow, a beast whose heart lies in resonance with the departed witches. These crows act as witches' loyal servants, protecting their tears from falling into human hands. That's cool. So there, those are the crows that we've been collecting. Another one of these. One more, now we get two. We got the two halves. Ah, oh, yes. We, we need to go into the gates of hell. Take care of my babies, will you? Some people may have a thing for the 45s, but to me, these are the real works of art. Right. Stuff coming soon. Definitely need more health items. I'm gonna get a mega one as well. They're sold out. I'll buy another one of these. Slash into an opponent with incredible quickness and deliver a devastating thrusting attack. And also be performed midair. Towards an enemy press triangle can also be ex Oh, I actually like this. I'm gonna buy this. This must have been used during the training of witches. Stepping on it gives it hints of some sort of faint movement. I think I need to jump on it from a distance. Because she stomps pretty hard when she jumps off high things. Like this. Yes! That's awesome. Your Jormungar's staff. Uh-oh. Who is this? I'm about to get my ass beat by Ardor. Ow. Yes! Oh my god, look at the sword. Look at the sword, bro. Eh, look, I'll take it. It's fine. I'm not trying to get a good rank or anything. Oh, look at the sword! Oh my god. My overall experience with this game is just... Like, I, I just... I'm still in disbelief that I've stayed away from this game for so long. I don't know why. I think as the years went on, I just said, you know what? There's no point in me playing this because it's an older game. But like, looking at it now, this game still looks fantastic. And it plays better than any modern slasher game that I've played in a long time, dude. Slasher, hack and slash, whatever you want to call it. I've just, I'm just having an absolute blast with this, dude. I really am. But I am genuinely having such a good time with this. What is that? Is that a... Wait a minute, is that the dragon from the start of the game? Ow! Oh my god. Oh my Jesus, I'm getting my ass kicked again! I got him. That was terrible. I lost a lot. Why do I have a feeling there's gonna be more enemies to fight? Here. Okay, we made it. Ooh, 
bats. Oh. Lever. Wait. What's up here? What was that bullet? Pieces of brutally destroyed witch statue, some kind of power source preventing it from reforming. Oh, we're about to find out what exactly that is. Oh, these guys again? Ow. Oh my god! These guys are testing my patience. Hey! I'm stuck! No fair! Alright. I know when I get the claws, I can destroy him. Okay, I'm gonna try not use my potions next time. If I need to die, I'll die. Those potions are expensive. Oh yes, so stylish. Wait, what's down here? Oh my god, it's so rainy and blustery. Ooh, what's this? Enter Alfheim. Oh, <gasps> I'm here. Limited kicks and punches. Defeat all the angels before time expresses. Expresses, expires using the limited number of punches and kicks allowed. So we need to do... And I died. Oh man, that's tough. That's tough. I'll come back to that. Nearly freaking died, bro. Ow. Ow. Stupid wind. Oh my god. Look at the dragon. This is another, another boss fight. Incoming. I got another piece. I got the whole thing. All the pieces fit together to form an Angelic Hymns gold LP. Some sort of silhouette is drawn upon the surface. Oh, <gasps> cool. We'll have to go back to to the gates of hell now. I think that'll unlock a new weapon for us. Oh, shit. Really? Oh, you ass. You nearly got me. My platform and skills are on point. Oh. Yes. Okay, here we go. Time to face the dragon. Or serpent. Inspired. Right, so what's this gonna take now? Yes!
Okay, held. Or I'm gonna die. Narco! Let's finish this. Here we go. Oh my god, let's go. Let's go, Hair Crow! Get it? Hair Crow? Like the Scarecrow? It's this bed out of hair. Never mind. Delicious. Nom noms. Yes. <laughs> So did she eat that with her hair? I wonder her hair is so shiny. And full of volume. Yes, dude. Let's go. Let's... Oh my god, I never noticed that. But you can actually see the shadow of her wings. Right, we're going to go in here now and see what exactly did we get. That's brand new. Another LP? <laughs> Working me to the bone. But no need to pity me. I was bored anyways. Let me go whip some things into shape for you. Gonna come back getting his ass beat again. <laughs> this took a bit of pound into shape, but the workmanship's solid. Now, go put this thing to good use. Holy crap! That's like the the two dudes that I was fighting. How? Looks like I got some saving up to do. I'm gonna go back through a lot of the chapters anyway and save up some some dosh because I don't want those. I want those bad. Rodan and the gates of hell. Okay, we're going to get some lore from Rodan. There is a place beloved by wanted men and rogues where money and power rule all. It is where I have established my office. Those who call this place by its given name are instantly identified as newcomers. As the tired hands of this rat hole all call it by a single name only. The dump. <laughs> Bloody battles and dirty disputes over money are an everyday occurrence here, and the concept of concern for one's fellow man was long since lost on the dump's denizens. They thirst for the uproar, only the occult can inspire the appearance of a spectre, a man being devoured by a demon. These are the snacks they eat as they drink and cavort in the dump's numerous watering holes. It is a place that I have come on my pil pilgrimage in search of, a grasp on reality. The dump is a wretched hive for all sorts of scum and villainy, home to everyone from black market businessmen to informants and devil hunters in between. But amongst them all, one man is particularly strange. His name is Rodan, a proprietor of the gates of hell, Bar. His front may his front may be that of a bartender, but rumor has it he is actually an arms dealer. Of course, if a man such as himself were to visit his establishment, there is no way all of his secrets would be laid bare. However, I can tell just by the air around him that he is a dangerous man. Unlike the standard assortment of thugs in the place, he is a sort of danger on a truly different level. According to my colleagues, if one carries enough clout here, Rodan is known to provide a gun or blade should they fee prove satisfactory. That is all I have been able to wring out of people here. There are also rumours that if you enter the bar from some sort of hidden entrance, he will provide you things that money cannot buy, or so saith the gossips in this occult-obsessed town. They even go so far as to say these things are not made up via normal means, but are weapons made from materials available only in Inferno. In the dump, there are enough rumours to rot one's ear, and if I hadn't seen the fresco of the Trinity of Realities, a staple of the Vigridian religions on Rodan's wall, I would have dismissed talk of him as nothing more than these tall tales. In any case, if I am able to fully investigate this man's secrets, I will surely be able to obtain the truth I so desperately seek. However, aimless sniffing around in this town is a great way to wind up dead. I'll have to be prudent and not leave things to chance. It's such, it's such, such badass lore, dude. I love it.
Oh, that's four. A witch's vitality in crystallized form. Obtaining this item will increase the limit of vitality. Yes! I'm assuming this is where we go. Another one. Okay. And I'm dead. Got him. Nope, not yet. Got him. There we go. Guns work well, but I can't really do combos. The fence has been exposed to the elements, weakening it considerably. Just a little bit of effort. Should knock it right over. There we go. What? What is that? Oh, God. Run. Let's go, Bayonetta. Let's go. Okay, that's so hot. <laughs> Let's go. She's amazing. Whoa, what's going on here? The only ones meddling are your hapless minions. This will be taken care of in the manner I see fit. Your assistance is not required. She just I banished it. Coming here has given you a second wind. Feeling better, Bayonetta? See what you did there. You? And don't you dare say my long lost sister. I was going to say probably your sister. You've quite the active imagination. I guess not then. You and I once fought for the jewel upon the crown of the Umbra throne. And now that you've returned, my sleeping beauty, it is time to finish that fight. Wait. Now? You're gonna fight again? Time for daydreaming. <laughs> oh, what's her gun say? Oh my god! I've never seen this before. <laughs> That's incredible! Dude, they're the same! This is happening. This is happening, dude.
Whoa! What the freak? Wow! Let's go. Dude, this is so adrenaline pumping. It's crazy. platinum for this fight as well what's the matter sweetie afraid of something are you afraid me this is a waste of my time you're still not ready she just turned into a big cat And then butterflies and now a crow. That's so sick. Okay, we got to get over. What? Unleashing the beast within allows you to transform into an animal form and unlock mysterious magic. For instance, if you want were to unleash the power of a panther and transform into a beast, they would be granted speed and fast as wind, and would be able to surmount even the most dangerous of cliffs with ease. Oh my god, that's cool. Oh my, that was bloody amazing. I agree. So this is a newfound power that she had buried within, that she's just unleashed. This game, dude. This freaking game, dude! Oh my god! Oh, what a day. And my ranks are shit! <laughs> and I don't care! Alright, so proving ground ruins. Now you're gonna notice something here, lads. I got some claws. I got some big, beautiful claws. I tried out this new weapon, and I have to admit, I really, really like it. I think it's super powerful. And it just looks so cool. Now, a lot of you guys have been telling me as well in the comment section, which I notice a lot, is that holding down buttons actually, like, adds to the combat. So I'm going to try mess around here and, s and see what it does. So we're going to be doing that from now on with a lot of our combos. Okay, that's awesome. I do like the, the holding of the buttons because it adds extra combat. Oh, yes. I got I got an, a piece of an LP. Awesome. So I know that I've missed a couple of things in my playthrough as well. So I do apologize for that. Uh, I'll do my best to... Hey. Oh, I'll do my best to explore everywhere. Um... But uh, at the same time... Oh, we got something here. Yes! Antonio's journal! Let's see what Antonio has to say about entering Vigrid. The ancient city of Vigrid is largely inaccessible, surrounded by mountains on one side and the sea to the other. While the first glance this may seem incredibly inconvenient, it is said that Vigrid flourished primarily due to the presence of strong spirit energy within the land underfoot. The Umbra Witches and Lumen Sages, each with respective control over dark and light, must have needed a land re uh, replete with this spirit energy to enable them to oversee history. The waves of time have modernized Vigrid, spurring rapid development. However, its residents still avoid outside contact, preferring to maintain their own culture and religious outlook. Their only link with the outside world is a single long-distance rail line, Simply riding this train requires an application be submitted to Vigrid authorities. What? 
Once disembarking from the train, there is a further police search after which one is granted admission to the city. It seems that what allows Vigrid the ability to be so strict regarding immigration is the seemingly close link between Vigrid authorities and the Ithaval group. Who's the Ithaval group? Um, a conglomerate based in Vigrid, yet proving this link will require further investigation. All right, I think this is the first time they've mentioned it. all, maybe they haven't. But I think that that's highlighted. This is the first time they're mentioning it. So it's a conglomerate that's based in Vigrid. Let's continue. I've been so excited to continue story, bro. It's fast and tight with locks and change. Nothing that should stop me from opening it, of course. Yeah, you know what that means. We can kick its ass. <laughs> oh, okay. Here we go. I used it, lads! I used it! Let's go! Whoa! What the freak? How'd that happen? Whoa! Hey! Oh, it's mid combo, you ass! And. Oh, 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 we're doing the thing. We're doing the thing. Oh, damn. <laughs> this freaking game! Oh, God. I wasn't ready. What was I? Bro, I have to get some stylish points for that. That felt so good. I love how good this game feels. I love how good Bayonetta makes me feel, bro. <laughs> she makes me feel so good! Can people tell me in the comment section why Bayonetta is amazing, please? Why is she so ama- What is this about? The surface has some beast-like footprints scrawled upon it. It seems like it is some sort of switch. Okay, so we know that's a switch. Oh, I need to press all of these. Before the time runs out. Uh-huh. I see. Okay. So... Right. Uh, we need witch time for this, I think. The door is sealed tight. It already seems a like a sturdy steel door, but magic has also been used to strengthen the seal. Okay, so there's no uh, smashing through that. Right, so what the feck are we supposed to do? Maybe it's a pattern, actually. Maybe it's a puzzle. Maybe you press this one. And this one. Oh, what if we used our awesome transformation and pressed all the buttons super fast? I think that'll work. Because we go super fast in this form. Our panther form is badass. Check. Yes, it works! I'm a genius! Big galaxy brain! Oh, it's the little girl again. The wish statue here is also terrible shape, but restoring this one to its former glory should be easy by now. Right then! We fought one of these before, so we just need to fight another one. Ah! God friggin' damn it. Oh my god, I actually got him. That's sick. Hey! Got one. <laughs> Give me my sonic rings. Come at me. I dare you. Oh, he's actually on a rampage now for some reason. Here we go. Oh, what? Oh! Oh! Sorry, I got too excited. I pressed pause. Oh my god! My queen! She is incredible! Come on, eh? Oh my god, look at her go! Yes! Yes! Eat him! Eat him! 
Um, 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 um. Come on, let's get back to the points. Yes. Yes. This game. I know it seems like I'm over exaggerating, but like I'm not. I think a lot of you guys can relate with how much like adrenaline and energy this game gives you. Because once you get good at it, I mean, I got platinum. That's proof that I'm okay at this game. But once you get somewhat decent at it, it becomes like so fun in like an in a, like an addictive kind of way. Does that make any sense? This is so cool. I love the witch time thing as well. It reminds me of Devil Trigger so much. I love that you can switch as well. It's incredible. You can actually switch to and from um, different elements with this weapon. That's why I really like it. It's the little girl! Come back here, little girl! Wait, what? Booby traps, bro? Shall we try and, um... What's that bat doing? Shall we try, like, just... Y'all of this? Oh, shit. Oh, wait, there's... Oh! There's buttons to press, bro. Oh, yeah, I, I got this new ability where I can actually turn into bats. So, we can't actually press this button. So, how do we do this? Oh, dear. Shit. That's... That's not fun. What's this? Can I hit this? Oh, there's a lever here! Okay. Yeah, okay. Shit. Okay. Not good, not good. Whoa! What was that about? Okay. I'm not doing so good. Oh, that's so sick. This game's incredible, bro. In so many ways. And by the way, I love all of your comments on why you, lo you love Bayonetta. It just makes me love her even more just to see how much passion there is for this character and this franchise, you know? And I'm so happy that Nintendo took it on. And how dare the likes of Sony and Xbox not see the potential in this franchise? Okay, so now the buttons are there. We got another Antonio log. Everyone carries within them a record of their evolution as being since time immemorial. It is this inner knowledge that the magical arts call upon when a practitioner uses the transformative technique known as the beast within. Now we've we've come acquainted with this ability. While there is very little documentation regarding this technique, it is comparatively easy to guess as its workings. It is even easier when one considers how many works of art depicting this condition fill museums to this very day. These works capture the very moment when a witch transforms herself into an animal. Present day interpretations never seem to escape the realm of dismissing these works as an artist's daydreams. However, when viewed from a different perspective, they are an important reference point in researching the magical arts. These pictures illustrate the unbelievable transformation of the Umbra Witch via the most special of means. Seeing her take the form of various animals, the witches were able to freely use this technique, transforming into beasts for incredible speed, or birds to send themselves soaring into the sky. Yeah, I love that. So we've, we've become acquainted to disability. As you know, I can actually turn into a panther, but I can also turn into a swarm of bats. 
when I take damage. That's after I take damage, I can actually turn into bats. I haven't quite used that yet properly. Whoa, Jesus Christ, I thought that was a disc being... Oh, hey! Oh, God! Hey! Hey! Hey, look, we're, we're related now! I got... I'm just... I got fancy claws, too! Ah! So what I figure out is that he's actually quite weak to the opposite and vice versa. Oh yeah! Now we'll switch. Oh, what the freak? Okay, that was impressive. I'm not gonna lie. Come on. Whoa! Don't you freaking dare hit me with that tornado, bro. Got him. Oh, what? I was not expecting another. What? Let's get this. Let's get this. Let's go! Oh my god, dude! They're getting me good here! Oh god! They are kicking my ass! To be fair, I wasn't expecting another another duo to be Jesus. Will you give me time to breathe? All right. You want the torture device? You get the torture device by the queen herself. Bay of fucking Neda. Hey! Down! Kitty. Okay, that was pu poorly judged. <laughs> to be fair, I'm not doing too badly, I think. I think this game genuinely is quite challenging. <laughs> so I think I'm doing okay. Little girl. Little girl. Oh, shit. The angel arms... Or angel weapons, whatever you want to call it, are really, really strong, bro. Excuse me, what? I see. Y you want me to summon the beasts? Oh. 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 Bad angel. Oh my god, it's game, bro! Look how badass that is. Look how badass that is. Oh god, I got a silver. Okay. <laughs> okay, I don't have a lot of health, but I'm gonna keep going until I can't. I do have some health lollipops though. What are you boys doing in here? Are you hiding something from me? Come on. You tease. My god. <laughs> I live for these cutscenes now, you know that? I I literally live for these cutscenes. Oh my god, the booty shot! <laughs> the booty shot! You've been cheating on me, haven't you? Someone else to watch your eye? <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> so
Something tells me I'm going to regret this. Oh, she wears glasses too. Yeah, what's he mean by that? What do you mean by that? Oh! Here we go! Oh my god, I love this. The music as well when he kicks in the slow motion, bro! How do I use that ability? Wait, wait, wait! This is something new! Oh no! I died! And I used my thingy. Oh my god, she's incredible! She is incredible! so much bro <gasps> a mother's love and we got some umbra and tears of blood wait just singing wait what whoa 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 what I am not your mother but mommy Will you quit calling me mummy? I thought the, the trophy or the achievement I earned was was just a figure of speech. If there's two things I hate in this world, it's cockroaches and crying babies. Well, a crying baby cockroach would be truly terrible. You're telling me... So don't you dare cry. Bayonetism. Yes, mummy. A four-letter word that I'm not gonna say, just in case. You've got to be a strong little one to survive in a place like this. What's your name, anyway? Cereza. Cereza. What a nice what name. Who are you, little one? Where are you from? Uh, I'm from my house. Well, now, I'll hazard a guess. This isn't your home. So what on earth are you doing here? My daddy told me to come here. And whereabouts is this daddy? Oh, yeah. then who is the dad? Love, but now I don't know where he's gone. I want to go home. I can't just drag you along wherever I go, anyone. So you'd better not be getting attached to me. Yes. My oh, God, look at her hair. Oh. Come now, little one. I'll help you out of here. Her hair is silky good. black, like... And you have to promise there'll be no crying. A single tear and you'll be crying alone. Bro! Got it? Okay, Sorry. Baby. Lights were flashing in the background. I think my lights are gone on the fritz because Bayon is a babe. And now I know she's got... Don't come too close to mummy, okay? You might get electrocuted, little one. Does she actually follow me? Oh my god, that's adorable! <laughs> Look at her little trot! I, I won't leave you. I won't leave you, little one. Here, come into my arms. Oh, actually, maybe not. Don't, don't, don't come into my arms right now. Now, see, mummy kicks doors. You shall kick doors when you're older, too. Okay, mummy. 
This way. Oh my god, you're so cute. Now, this is the way a woman walks. <laughs> I'm having way too much fun. Wow, well, mommy, it's a bit windy outside. Yes, it is. And I'm not your mum. <laughs> Alright, let's have a look at this journal. Story time, story time. <laughs> In recent days, Vigrid has seen the rise of the Atho Ithaval group, a conglomerate whose rapid development has changed the face of the city. Their man-made island off the coast of Vigrid, Isla del Sol, is a clear example of their techno technological style. It is a modern metropolis, home to many residents. However, their flight from the old city has led to the onshore historical district's rapid decline, a process that will likely end in the eras in the areas becoming ruins free of inhabitants. Those who live on Isla del Sol and those who have remained in this old city all worship the Laguna gods who are the heart of their fate. In many ways, like sun worship, this faith has been at the people's core since ancient times and forms the very heart of their cultural development. It is said the Ithaval group itself was developed in conjunction with the Laguna and its CEO is held up as the paragon of Laguna worship, the living symbol of the people's faith. He is purported to be descended from the said to be annihilated Lumen Sages, although I cannot confirm the veracity of this claim. At any rate, the devotion which people hold towards the Ithoval group is with, without question. Vigrid's appearance is not the only part of the city's city to have changed completely. The ancient fate in the Laguna is now inexorably linked to the Ithoval group as it pushes forward its modernizations. Thus the city has lost its previous visage to be replaced at alarming speed, and all with the apparent consent of the Laguna worshipping Vigrid Vigridians. Man, there's some, there's some really hard words in this game. It's either that, or I'm stupid and I can't read. Alright little ones, don't get lost now. Follow mommy. Uh, you stay here while I get rid of the beasties. Wait. What do we? Oh, hey. Oh. Okay, looks like I need to hit them with inanimate objects. Okay. Whack. All right, we good? We good. Can I hit this? Oh. Oh, right. Okay, come on now, little one. Don't get hurt. Now, that's how we open locked gates, okay? We're allowed wherever we go. Because we are witches and we do whatever the f we want. Right. Just gonna whack this. Okay, let's... Ah! All right, I, I needed that. Ah, all right. Hey! Ah! Leave... Get back, beast. Shit. Ow! Fuck! 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 Wait, are we all out? Oh god! You leave my kid alone! Which I don't think is my kid, but I'm just gonna say it's my kid. Okay, because I have no recollection of having a child. Uh, I'm coming, kid. Hey. Oh, shit. Ah! Oh, my. Leave her alone. Come on, run, kid. Whack. Hey. Whack. Come on, kid. Okay. We didn't... We didn't do so good now, to be fair. Ah, you can't fit, you big fat piece of sh There is a heavy lithograph here. It depicts the seal of the sun. The seal of the sun, you say? Oh! Portal! Paradiso. Glimpse of a temple.
Hey! Hey, what are you running after? This is probably how you got lost to begin with. Oh shit! Mommy. Don't worry, it's always scary the first time you see them. So, where was I? I love it when the music kicks in! Yes, your kind invitation. I do hope you've prepared dessert as well. Let's go, Bayonetta! Yes, dear, mommy's a badass. A lovely tea party. And dancing, too. Cereza, my dear, watch and learn. Ah! Yeah, just ignore that. Ignore that part. Hey, cut that out. Ah! Oh, my God. Okay. These guys are hard, bro. Ah! Oh, my God. Okay, we Okay, we need to use item. We 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 need to. You leave her out with this! Ah! I'm actually getting my ass kicked here, dude. Hey! Oh my god! Okay. The, the, god, why are these guys so hard? Oh, he dies. So that was a quick tutorial of how not to beat these guys. Let me show you how to actually beat them now. Doing way better now. See you later! Okay, this is when they go on a bit of a rampage. Here you go! Minute! again oh this is the other side that's right so we can actually whoop this guy's ass now okay what is happening uh oh here we go oh no little one oh <gasps> he broke it Wait, what? What the hell? Hey! Give me back my kid! your obsession with her oh my god dude she's incredible <laughs> let's go that's what you get Almost got maximum. 
What? what? Did, did it fall in love with her cuteness or what? Like, what, what was that about, dude? We got gold. It's not bad. Not great, but not bad. Wait. Excuse me, what? What is... Wait, what? That's... Hey! Hey! Get back! Get back here! Wait a minute, that was an imposter? What 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 the hell is going on? Two? Two bayonetas? I'll take two bayonetas to go, please. <laughs> yes. Oh. Oh. Oh, yes. Oh. Yes. Yes. Ten for for both of you. What? Oh my god. <laughs> Joy! <laughs> what sort of seductive behavior is this, bro? What? Here. Here you go. Come over here. Oh. Uh. Control yourself. D don't look at me like that. Close your mouth. Control yourself. Okay? Stop it. Get some milk. Behave. <laughs> this game... <laughs> this game is incredible. <laughs> I got another uh, piece of the LP. Another piece of the journal as well. Oh my god, that was so cool. The Angel's Banquet Hall, Alfheim. Vigard has long held the notion that the world is comprised of a trinity of realities. Paradiso, Inferno, and the human world. However, since the era of the witch hunts, the Gridians have held that Paradiso, the world of light, is the most perfect of these realms and have worshipped it as such. Yet, as normal human beings are unable to experience this heaven, the Vigridians' feelings regarding Pardiso manifest themselves in various ways. Even 
Porta del Paradiso, ruins of which remain to this day, were born of this fate and placed around the city as an act of Paradiso worship. These structure stone discs, three meters in diameter, were said to represent portals into Paradiso itself. It was believed that when the gods extended the people of Helping Hand, they would do so via the portals guiding them to Paradiso. Thus, the Porta were placed in spiritual powerful locations. Within Paradiso, there are said to be secret rooms known as Alfheim, where angels gather and hold their banquets. The Porta del Paradiso, created by man, are said to mimic the entrances to these Alfheim. Legend has it that if someone were to stumble across one of these portals while in Purgatorio, they may enter an Alfheim, upon which the angels would entertain the lost visitor and bless them justly. I, I love the fact that these journal entries actually give us lore to the things that are actually in the game, like the portals and uh, those um, crypts or whatever you call the things that you break and you get items in. I, I love that. I love how we get explanations for all these things. They're not just there for aesthetic. They genuinely have lore. Speaking of, where's, where's the kid? Sariza? Darling? Where are you? Did I say her name right? <laughs> I feel like I didn't. No, honestly, where, where, where's the kid? Where, where's the little girl gone? I must find... Her. Oh, well, look who it is. It's Luca. Why is Luca with the little girl? Mommy! Mommy? You're a mom? You? Come now, Cheshire. Look at me. Do I look like I have any interest in children? Now making them? Well, that's another story. Oh, <laughs> what? Whoa, whoa. You're getting the wrong idea. I mean, it might be the right idea, but not right now, right? Right? <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah, uh... Speaking of right, I'm glad I've been standing around waiting for you, because I knew we'd cross paths. See, the only way to reach the upper crust in their gated island of champagne wishes and caviar dreams is over Prominence Bridge. Oh, yes. The island. Lovely place, isn't it? Oh, now what? Don't play games with me. You've worked your magic on this poor defenseless child, haven't you? You're a sad, sick woman, you know that? I was her age when you killed my father. Wait. No. You couldn't. Oh my god, you did, didn't you? You killed her parents! Whoa there, cowboy. Come to think of it, she's better off with you. You two are more hassle than you're worth. What? Just keep a good eye on her, or you're going to catch hell for it. No good deed goes unpunished, and you never know when a monster may sneak up on you. Mummy, look out! Mummy's on it. Oh shit, why are bridges always breaking? <laughs> Mommy, no! So now Luke is looking after Sariza. Sariza? Sariza? I keep forgetting it from saying her name right. She can see you because she's probably a witch too. Oh my god, this was definitely one of my favorite episodes, bro. This is so good. And that oh, is a shit rank. Oh, straight into a cutscene. Oh, okay. Uh, she didn't even flinch. Every single time. She impresses me. Wait a minute. Are we jumping straight into a boss fight? I feel 
like a fucking celebrity this is not good. Town. This is not good. This is not good because I haven't played this game in about a week. This is going to be entertaining to you guys, though. See that? Everyone rushes at me like crazed fans. They still haven't figured out that I don't give autographs. She took off her glasses there. Did you see that? Did you see that? I'm not much for the talkative types. How about we have a little fun instead? You did plan on having fun with me, right? What? Okay, that was cool. Talk afterwards. Oh. <laughs> oh god! Oh god! Oh god, it's too soon for this! Okay. 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 Everybody. Uh, okay. Oh. What am I hitting? What? What? What is happening? What? What? Oh. Okay. Um. We're jumping around. It seems. Right now, where is he? Oh. Okay, I'm not- I don't know- I'm not sure if I'm doing alright or not. I take a need to wreck this thing. Nice. Nice, I'll take that. What? Oh god. Okay. Oh dear. Okay. Oh, okay. Um, we're not wearing all our clothes. Okay, now we are. Shit. Um, I am- I genuinely was not prepared. Okay, we need to jump, and we need to jump to this, and 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 and we're here now, and I don't know what I'm supposed to do, but I'm just going to try survive. Okay, I keep missing the jump prompt. Right, I need to figure this fight out. Am I supposed to jump on this? No. Okay, no. Um... Oh shit! Ow! Oh god, that was a direct hit. I am not. Oh, uh, I keep missing the jump prompt. Okay, it seems I can just stay fighting in the air, which is great. Okay, now I'm down. Alright. Okay, this fight is a little bit awkward. Because I haven't a clue what I'm doing, but I think I can... I'm pretty sure I can figure this out. Okay, okay, we're doing something good here. Right. I, I assume we need to run. Ow. Ow. Oh shit. Uh, okay. Can't you tell I'm rusty now? Okay, what what are we the hell am I supposed to do here? Oh look, look, look! Okay, okay, now no Alright. Here comes the hair. Whoa, 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 whoa! What the hell? Uh. Oh, shit! Oh my god, she's my queen! Okay, we're not doing... Uh, I mean, awful. Oh! 
okay. Oh, okay. Okay, we're throwing a boss. We are throwing a boss. Whoa. Right. This fight is actually intense. Okay. All right, we're good. We, we got that now. Okay, where where is this thing? Oh, there it is. Okay, we're doing this again. This is awesome. All right, all right, all right. Here we go. Here we go. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Oh my god. Yes! Let's go! Now we're aiming for the head. Okay, no, maybe not. We need all oh, here. Weak spots. Okay, let's let's get let's get some healing. Because we need. Oh my god, dude, this fight is so well put together. At the same time, it's just pure chaos. And I think that's the whole purpose. Oh my god, that was a direct hit on my... I'm being a little bit reckless with this fight, but it is my first time playing it. And I'm just kind of going with the flow right now. So... Oh, oh god, okay. We're gonna need some more healing if we want to survive this. Nice. Nice. Alright. Oh, the shield down? Yes! Now we can aim for the face! Oh my god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh my god. Okay, now he's got wind. Oh god. Oh my god. We had, we almost have him. Oh shit, that was a direct hit. Oh my god, it's neck and neck. Oh god. Oh no. Okay, maybe I can... Alchemy. I'm not going to get anything to write home about rank wise, but oh my girl, my lady, my queen, beat the solid shit out of him. Conor McGregor, his ass, girl. Oh. Ew! Oh, there's nothing left of his face! All done. Well, let me give you back your toy then. <laughs> really? 
She just caught a boss <laughs> with one arm. Bugger. And I didn't make any time for pillow talk. Hey, he's okay. Uh, almost. Oh. I genuinely was hoping and rooting for the guy. Um, shit. Uh oh, here we go. Get ready for the worst rank of all time. This was a terrible rank. Hey, okay. I genuinely thought I was going to do a lot worse than that, so I'll take it. So where does our next chapter take us now? <gasps> Salvation Highway? Did I read that correctly? Route 666. Oh my god. Okay. This is awesome. So, first things first, lads. I just want to get this out of the way so everybody can feel my pain and suffering. It is really warm over here in Ireland for some feckin' reason. I don't know why. But I am melting in my office. I have no air conditioning. I have a fan that feels like it's just blowing warm air at me. So that might as well be off at this stage. So I'm very, very warm. So I do apologize if I get really uncomfortable. And may have to stop recording at some stage. But I'm going to struggle on. For the sake of Bayonetta. And for the sake of how great this game is. So now I think we should be going into like a normal level. And not so much of a, a boss fight we'll say. in these heels? I don't suppose I can call a cab to get me to the island. Oh my god, look who it is! And it's me daughter! vehicle is he driving? He didn't even put any seat belts on Sarayza. Uh oh. So cute. Did you see that? I told you there was nothing to worry about. Mummy, mummy saved us. What? Yeah, she knows. Shit. <laughs> it seems your driving is on par with your journalism. I figured I'd beat you to the island, but the guards had another idea, didn't they? Not really my best plan, huh? You think you've got me figured out, don't you? We journalists have to have some detective skills, you know. You're after a gemstone, and that stone has to be in the Ithaval group building. I'm headed there too. How odd. You seem to know where I'm going before I do. Yet you don't seem to know how to drive a car in a straight line. What am I? A chauffeur? Cheshire, do you have any idea what prolonged walking in this salty air will do to my hair? Well, I tend to use some product when I go to the beach. 
Uh oh. Little one, get down. Put your foot down, Cheshire. I'll take care of our pest problem. <sighs> Wonderful. All right. So are we get in a unique level here. I think there's gonna be a lot of shooting. Maybe some platforming. I'm getting the distinct impression I'm not wanted on that island. But I love it when people play hard to get. Oh yeah. Okay. Okay. Now, like I said, I'm a little bit rusty, so. Wait, can I? Oh my! I can. Oh, yeah, I knew there was gonna be like platforming and stuff. Hey! I was in the middle of punishing. Can I go up here? Yes, I can. Oh, that's amazing. Oh, I'll use this. Thank you. I think I can. Oh! Wait, what happened? I'm assuming that wasn't supposed to happen, right? There you go. <laughs> Woo! This is awesome. Oh god. Oh, do I lose health when that happens? Yes, yes I do. I and I and I lose a lot. It seems. Okay. So where where's Where am I? Oh fuck. Okay, I'm supposed to go over this way, I'm assuming. I am having a hard time platforming here. Okay. I didn't think this was going to be this difficult. Okay, that was awful. Because I hadn't a clue what I was doing. But it's okay. We got through it. This isn't supposed to be a perfect playthrough by any means. Play the game with your mouth closed, DB Geek. Alright, I'm... I'm... Oh god, it's... Oh, it's her! It's... It's... Oh... There's... It's... It's... It's two of them! Um... Let's... Let's try... Oh, there's... There's... Okay, there's three! And I have to avoid moving vehicles? Are you serious? the treasure what okay stop with the sexy poses me and I mean why, why would I tell her to do that I have no idea I take that back oh, yeah. oh, ow. we both got creamed on that one I feel like we're gonna get hit by a car soon yes oh my god Oh my god, these fights are getting so much more challenging. <sighs> oh my god. Wait, now what? Wait, we got car enemies now? And I got a motorcycle. And there's the middle finger. That's the key. Oh, excuse What? It just never stops with this game, does it? It just never stops. 
Oh! Okay. Oh, this is awesome! Oh my god, the speed! Whoa! I nearly didn't make that. I don't know what the hell is in front of me! Oh my god, I don't have a whole lot of health left. Ow! Jeez. I'm not doing so great. Oh, damn! This is... Okay, I need to stop going so fast. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. Oh, I pressed it, though. Oh, God. Yikes. Okay, that was badass. Whoa. Oh, my God. Oh. This is so... Freaking fast paced, high octane, adrenaline pumping madness! That's so cool that you can trigger witch time there as well. Isn't it? Oh my god, and the music as well. There's so much happening that I'm not even paying attention to the music right now. Whoa! <laughs> Let's go! That was sick! Oh my god. Bro! Oh my god, I thought the... thought the highway ended there. Look at this, lads. No HP. Oh my... Oh, oh! Oh my god. Jesus! How much more left? Oh my god. I don't have much left in the tank, lads. Oh god, yikes! Oh no! I actually thought I was gonna get to the end. Clearly not. Okay, let's try this again, except I'm gonna go super fast. I know exactly what I'm doing now. This is all good in the hood. Let's go. We all about that speed, baby. Let's get these pedestrians out of the way. Ow. Alright. Here we go. Pop. Pop. Ah. Oh yeah! <laughs> Did you see that speed? That's what I'm talking about right there. Ah, yeah. Ah, come away. Don't underestimate a gamer when they play the same thing twice. Watch me. Ah. Ah. This game is so freaking awesome. It has no right to be this hard. Or go this hard. Oh god. Ah! <laughs> Bro. <laughs> I'm surprised I even made that. Drift. Oh my god. A drift. I'm so sick. Okay, right, um, oh, what? Stop, oh, uh. oh. I don't even get a second to lie down after that. For fuck's sake, that's overdoing it. Right, turn right. Get off the road. Uh oh. <laughs> the hell is that a meteorite kick? I know you don't want me here, but you really could have been more subtle about it. Oh shit. <laughs> All right. So these guys are new. 
Braves. Right then. Looks like it's Braves on the menu. It's okay. I'm gone. I'm, I'm, I'm fine. It's okay. It's fine. Ow. Oh god. Okay. I'm nearly dead. It's fine though. And I'm dead. I was um I was doing okay until I until I wasn't. What is he doing? Is he doing martial arts? Wait! Whoa. Wait a minute. Did they just fuse? Okay, they didn't do this the last time. Ow. Okay. Oh my god. Get out of it, dickhead. Oh my god. I can't see this dickhead. Where is he? Oh god. Bro, I'm I'm a goner, dude. Oh my god. Whew, I am sweating right now. Oh shit! I actually came close to beating them the first time because they never fused. But then again, I think that's because I actually killed one of them off quite quickly, maybe. So they couldn't fuse. Oh my god. Oh my god, I almost had him! Okay. Ow! My damn fingers! <laughs> Combat-wise, that was awful on my half, on my part, but we did it. We did it. Oh my god. That was, yeah. Oh, what a day. That seems about right. That's, that, yeah. Wait. What's this about? Paradiso, a remembrance of time. Wait, now lads, just a reminder, if you guys are enjoying the video, make sure you hit that like, subscribe to the channel, and comment down below why you love Bayonetta. That way you get automatically put into the draw in order to win the Bayonetta Trinity Masquerade Edition. And I'm going to be personally adding Bayonetta 1 and 2 to that prize. Paradiso. Graveyard of Remembrance. Jesus, this is My dear, sweet this lad again. <laughs> this clock face, I've seen it somewhere before. Right. Wait. A massive spirit energy at the same wavelength as angels. It seems the spirit energy around here naturally gathered up to form this thing. I suppose it's a platform. That's cool. Okay. Dude. I, uh, do you know what? It's commentary time. I'm really enjoying my time with this game. Because it's got this raw... Adrenaline fueled action that I've missed so much from my video game years, if you will. I've enjoyed Devil May Cry as a series so much, but that was during my early stages of gaming. And 
up until obviously Devil May Cry 5, which was a little bit more recent, but this is like reigniting something that I've missed in video games in so many years. And it's so refreshing, but yet familiar at the same time. And I love it. On top of that, the environments, the art style, the just incredible imagination that goes into something like this is astounding. And I, I absolutely adore it. I really, really do. Massive respect to the artists and everybody involved in this game. Like, look at this. Look at all the angels. This is incredible. It's, it's just so mind-blowing. What's this thing? Oh, oh, okay. Oh, man. Did you really just interrupt that? Hey, that dude's got a keyblade. Blow your trumpet elsewhere, asshole! I want to get this keyblade. Keyblade! All right, we got a keyblade. Can I whack this? I feel like this can be whacked. Okay, never mind. Right, where are we going? Are we going this way? Okay, we can't go that way because there's an invisible force field there. Let's run this way then. Okay, we can't go that way either. Okay, there's obviously something that we need to do here then. Ah, oh, yes, the Keyblade. <laughs> I knew there was something to do with the statue. I just couldn't figure it out because I'm a dumb dumb. There we go. Ooh. I got a piece of an LP. I need to collect all those. Right, I take it we're going this way then. Enter Alfheim? Yes. Oh, this is... Okay, defeat all the angels before time expires. You must be out of body to defeat the enemies. Okay. <laughs> I'll come back to those. They're not my main priority at the moment. Is making progression in the game is. Maybe we're supposed to go somewhere up. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> this is what I was supposed to do. Okay. Oh, what the hell? Get out of it. So I got another key. I'm assuming I put this. Oh, here. Oh, what's happening? More platforms. This is. Hey, I got a platinum. It's it's about fucking time. Am I supposed to? Oh. Okay. Somewhere I'm supposed to go here. Oh god. Run. 
I've gotten quite used to that, to be honest. Woo! I made it. Easy. That was cool. No damage. I should have got a platinum for that. That's bull. There is an ornate staff sticking out from the gear mechanism. It seems like one of the cogs may be missing. So I need a cog then, is that what you're saying? And there's the cog. Woo! You spin me right round, baby, right round, like a record, baby, right around, right around. All right, I, I, I'm getting really dizzy now. What's happening? Do we just stay going until... Bayonetta just can't spin no more? Alright, we're almost there. Jesus, this is a bit much. A bit excessive, no? Alright, and we connect the two bridges. Boom, there we go. And I'm dizzy. Okay. Smash pot. Keyblade. Giant Sphere. Right. There's one part. We're good. The damn giant spear. Alright, use this lad as a, an oldest fraction. Oh. Okay, now we got the two of them. Oh my god, that was a bad idea. Now I set them all free. Okay, how do we kill all the- Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna need some stuff. Oh, I got squished. Oh my god, I actually got squished. Does that not hurt them though? Yeah, it does. Okay, I think it does. That's cool. We can just leap them into it. Nice. Nice. Yeah, that's it. Keep squishing them. That's it. Give me the advantage. There we go. Ah. <laughs> that's so freaking loony. I love it. Come on. Oh god. Oh! <laughs> okay, touche, my friend. Touche. That was that was good. Now, I'll give it to you. It's only taking a, a little bit of health off him, but it's still doing something. Ow! Oh god. Nice. Saved by the giant spear. Almost, almost have him. Oh my god. Oh, come on, dude. No! No! Okay, I got him. Jeez. That was really annoying with the spear dropping and shit. That was starting to bug me big time. Okay, let's pick this up. Let's, let's do this thing. Put it in me squasher. 
Okay. Okay, this is cool. These platforms are... Are moving at an immense rate! Ah! Bollocks! I'm after falling to me death! Oh my god. I'm dizzy. Oh, good god. I made it. Ooh. I will take that. Thank you very much. Oh no. Oh shit. Is this a boss fight? Is that a is that a ship? Another feckin' boss fight. All right. Let's uh let's uh, go. As Mario would say. Oh no! As Mario would say. Hey, asshole! <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. We got a piece of LP. Oh. 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 This could be fun and difficult, it seems. Will this give us all the pieces we need now? No. Okay. Okay. Slow down and jump. Whee! Oh god. Okay. Woohoo! <laughs> Ow! Thorn! Woohoo! <laughs> oh god, me ass! Alright. Alright. Yes! Avoid! Oh! Okay. The phallus like branches. Move! Okay. This is fine. This is just like a Beyblade. All right. And Bulza. Oh, God, not this arsehole. Here you go. You ready? Get on the saddle. Handle uh, yeah, boobies. Yes, that's 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 right. Completely family friendly. This is. Oh! Oh my God! I can't believe she just. All right, on the saddle you go. Get up here. And... Uh, jiggle fizzly. Okay. <laughs> oh, I was going to say jiggle physics, but then I got so distracted by the actual jiggle physics, I couldn't actually say the word. <laughs> this fucking game, dude. <laughs> I can't, I can't. You know what? Well, you know when you're just genuinely trying to do commentary? I can't with this game. I just can't. I do my best. <laughs> it's just, it's just crazy. This game is, is absolutely nuts. And I, I love every, every second of it. I really do. Oh God, not the giant freaking spear again. All right, we can go down here. Yeah, let's go down here. I'm going to need some potions and stuff. So let's go down. You bring me enough of these halos. And maybe I can buy a ticket to space. Always wanted to be a bald space marine. 
<laughs> Did you now? What can I do for you anyways? Items, I suppose. I'll take some 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 of these. And I'll take a few of these. Thank you. What is this? Perfume for witches is made from unique fragrances. Will change you into a costume that is a perfect match for Durga? I I have enough money. Okay. I don't know what that is, but I bought it. Let's see what happens. Cat ears. <laughs> I spent 30,000 big ones for cat ears. Worth it. Okay. We're fine. Oh god! Ow! I'm fine. Oh god! Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm I'm I I have no idea what's happened. <laughs> Oh shit, now what? There's always an enemy here. At an area like this. Now I have to bite the giant spear? Sphere? Ah, ah, he said it! He said it! Oh, it's a Minecraft dragon! Oh my god! Jesus Christ! What the f What? What is happening? I'm. I'm not. I... I'm so dead! Oh! Okay, um... Wow! We can turn into a bird! And I'm dead! No, I'm not, because I got items, remember? That was a direct hit. Nice. I don't know why I'm praising the thing, because it's nearly killing me. Ow. 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 Oh, nice knee. Here comes the hair. Oh. We're, we're playing volleyball. Oh. What? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, this game is absolutely intense and I love it. Oh, I know I've gotten so used to these weapons, but I kind of feel like I want to switch back to some stuff. So let's equip these and then we can equip the sword. And for here, we can equip this. Yeah, I think... How does that work out? Oh my god, look! 
What? <laughs> I never actually... Oh my god, what the freak is happening? I have a tail! I... I'm a... I... I'm... I... I'm a, I'm a furry now. Um... <laughs> this has uh, definitely taken a turn. I don't know for the better or for the worse. <laughs> yes! Uh, I love this game so much. It, it makes me so happy. Oh, what a day. But that rank does not. <laughs> and there she is, my queen. Getting some more memories here. Secret. I've been there before. Sean? Cereza? The little one? <gasps> What's happening? What's an earthquake or No, this is something else entirely. What is that? Are those are those tentacles? Tentacles? Why did it have to be tentacles? Because reasons. I think that's the first time I've seen Bayonetta a little bit startled. I think she's more. Oh, we got these chicks. Oh. Let me finish my sentence. I feel like she got a little bit spooked in the areas that she's in and some of the memories she got back. First time I've seen her actually kind of scared. Just thought I'd point that out. Anyway. Oh! There you go. Come on, get on the pony. Good girl, get on now. Up you get. Okay. I love physics. Ha ha. Woo Here we go. <laughs> Come on. Come to mama. Up you get. Yeah. Okay. Alright. Watermelon! Ooh, okay. Yeah, pull a little too hard there. Hey, what the what is that? That was a good fight. That was awesome. I like that. I enjoy that. Oh. Thank you for the kiss. Hey, I got gold. Not bad, eh? Not bad for someone that hasn't played for like 12 freaking days. I know. Shame on me, right? Okay. So, as you all know and remember, the last episode kind of ended with us having a tail and ears. Because, um, why not? Also, I figured I can do this. I've got a fever. And the only cure is more dead angels. You want to touch me? 
Yes, I want to! What the freak? Oh god, more enemies. Come on, Nate. Your turn. In the box. Punch, 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 punch. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Looks like we are. We got more puzzles. Okay, so that's... We need two more. Let's go this way. Oh, here we go. Sweet. Nice. This weapon's really strong. Oh, yes. I think that's enough, right? Should be able to do something. Oh, no. One more. Up here. Nice. That was sick. There we go. Now we're now we're talking. All right, let's look around. So a lot of you guys in the comment section were telling me that I need to stop and look around a little bit more because there's stuff that I miss. Okay. Hang on. Okay. Round and round we go. There you go. Crush the demons. Oh, it's these. The, okay, the, the two of them. Okay. There we go. Crush him! Let's go! And Karachi! Nice. Didn't take any damage there, I don't think. Do I get a good reward? I got a platinum! Yay! And around and around we go. Whoa, what is with this camera? Bro, what the freak? Is that a platform over there? Okay, I think... We have to head over this way then. Oh, sweet! What's this? Let's open this first. Yes! Gimme! I've got a full, a full moon pearl. A full, a full moon pearl? Sailor Moon! Sailor Mercury! Sailor Mars! Sailor Jupiter! You were all thinking it. Come on. We're back in the jungle. Use Wicked Weaves. Give you all the angels before time expires. Enemies can be defeated using Wicked Weave attacks. Okay, this is... This is not going well. Ow. Ow. So how am I supposed to do wick weave attacks when I I have to turn it into a combo? Ow. Ow. Okay. There you go. I'm not very good at these challenges. Okay, maybe I wasn't done spinning on this thing. Oh, look. Okay. Need a There we go. Sweet. Oh shit. Okay. Woohoo! Surf's up, bro. Or chainsaw time. A slice and dice. There you go. There you go. Eat it. Oh, shit. Yeah. 
Got him. Nice. Ooh, we actually get to pick up this chainsaw? Okay. Whoa. Wait, where do... Where is it? Hey. Why did it teleport me there? Oh, shit. We got a chainsaw, bro. Oh, yes. Oh, what? Wait, we're fighting you again? Or just an, another version of you? Shit, I won already? Oh, God. Why am I fighting all these bosses again? Okay, here we go. <laughs> In your face. Oh, shit. Nice. Take that. I got this guy, I got him. Oof! We almost have him, lads, we almost have him. Oh shit, left. Oh, yes. We got him. Easy sauce. Let's go. Hey, it's not bad. I'll take it. It's weird that we're actually fighting the bosses again, except they're like nerfed versions. So it's actually not too bad. The artwork that goes into this game, dude. The, the, the imagination and this, this vision that they created is just... It's so fucking beautiful. I love it. Excuse my French. I had a feeling it wasn't over. The floating island took quite a hit, and now it's spinning. It will take good timing to jump across. Okay. <laughs> right. I guess we're... Okay, we're gonna have to do this right. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Ready? Ready? Steady, and, and, no! Woohoo! I'm good. I don't know what that wheel was, but it's destroyed now. How are we not, like, super dizzy right now? Are you whacking this? Yeah, we are. Oh, shit. Oh, dear God, this is trippy. What the fuck? happening i don't like this i don't like this make me nauseous are we supposed to jump down here yo oh what the fuck are they oh yeah it's a train thing we got to kill this ow Ah! Give me a game! Ah! What the fuck? Oh my god. Okay, this is not easy. Ah! Oh! 
I'm still alive somehow. I got it. I got it. Jesus. That was brutal, dude. I was getting my ass handed to me. What the fuck? Holy shit, dude. Oh my god. Ah! Oh god! I am on the brink of death. Oh, look at my shadow. Hey! Speed! Ow! Animate it! I'll take that. Ow, what the f <gasps> And I'm dead. Oh my god, they're so fast. What the hell? Why are they so quick? Which time doesn't work here? It's kind of difficult. Oh, not this been a Rooney thing. Oh my god. Okay, there's one. We got one down. We got one down. This is good. This is good. Golden Tan. Super Bayonetta. I got him! Oh my god! Jesus, they were hard. Holy shit! Oh! It's the baby! Sarisa! What happened to mummy? Well, you see, she just went to look for something. That's all. I can't believe that witch. Placing a poor, helpless child under her spell. If she did anything to this little girl's parents, I swear. Oh, sorry, Zafel. Pick the baby up. No, no, no need to cry. We'll get you to your mom in no time. Uh, here, I've got some candy if you want. It's yummy. I don't know. It's candy. Strawberry, I think. Hey, Kitty, I've got some yummies. Would you like some? Is that cat your friend? Yes, he is. His name is Cheshire. He's cute, isn't he? Cheshire. Cheshire. That is cute. Stupid name. Hey! Well, so much for taking the highway. Just means we're gonna have to find something else. How many lollipops does he keep? <laughs> Why does he wear that obnoxiously long what scarf? To figure out is what to do about you. Also, I, I don't know if I mentioned this before. Maybe I did in one of my videos. So, Teresita, that woman's really your mom? Uh huh. My mummy is strong, and she protects me from scary monsters. Wasn't that the same voice as the narrator for the Genshin Impact trailers? Monsters are. Oh shit, speaking of monsters, here we go. Oh my lord, I can't believe I survived. They were really strong. They were tough, man. This weapon better be super strong. Oh, really? Spikes? 
You're gonna hit me with the spikes, bro. I'm not sure if that was the way that was supposed to be done, but I, for some reason, got through that. <laughs> oh god, oh thank god, the gates of hell. Items. Definitely need some, some items. Oh, I forgot I have some mega green uh, lollipops. Get a red hot shot as well, because they're super handy. Which is hard. No, we're good. I feel like I do need a new ability at this stage, though. Unbrand portal kick. Open up magical portal warping above your opponent's head. And delivering a devastating kick, a wicked kick can also be summoned, depleting your magic gauge. Press circle while holding R2. Oh. We'll go with that one. Okay. Let's go down. Oh god. Oh Jesus. Where the gold? Ah! Get off me, dickheads! Ah. Get off me, arsehole! Oh yeah, I win. Ooh, okay. We're gonna do one or more of these things. Okay, so where do we need to go? <gasps> Why is there dragons? Okay, so what 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 is going on here? I think that's why I'm supposed to use it, is it? There he is. Well, now he's dead. Now what? Uh oh. Sweet! We won! There we go! Now I'm up! Oh! It's the razor! They're coming! Alright, that's chapter 10 done! Interesting chapter to say the least. Definitely a difficult one as well. I'm not getting be any better at this, am I? So we're on chapter 11 now, right? So we're coming off of there now. Oh, where are we now? Okay, here we go. Cereza. Oh, Cereza? Sis. Don't panic. I'm here. There's no need to worry about a thing. Oh, that was close. Holy crap. Get them, mommy, get them. Mommy. Can't you see? Mommy's fighting the bad monsters for us. Mister, if you don't open your eyes, you'll miss everything. Wait. <gasps> Holy crap. Just give her give him the power to see. Oh! 
Nice. Mommy's here. And the music kicks in at the perfect time. Yes. I love it. Oh my god, that was so badass. Now what? Whoa! What? <laughs> it's not like she needed saving. Oh, <laughs> see, uh, I don't need you. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> I love how this game has some goofiness to it. Oh no, it's Therese's glasses. Uh oh, not the tentacles again. Another boss fight. This is way too dangerous. Serazita. Oh no, Cheshire. You didn't. Oh my god. All of that to save Cheshire. No! We were so close. Well, Kitty, what do you think we should do? He's hurt you, has he? Well, we can't be having that now, can we? Okay. Yep, I've seen it all now. Auditio Dios Titia? Titia? I don't know what that is. But I'm gonna kill it. Yeah! I thought its head was a platform. Nice. Lo oh, my God. What is going on? Oh god! Oh god! Oh my god! Jesus! It's hard to keep track of this. Now what? What is she doing? Oh my god. This game is incredible. This is definitely going down as one of my all-time favorites. It is astounding. Ah. 
And we good. Oh, sick! Here we go. Oh man, this is crazy. Okay. Oh, drop kick! Yes! No chop! Yeah! <laughs> oh, I can't make it. It's too far away. Ah. Are we good? I did not see that coming. Ow. Ow, come on, bro. Okay. This is cool. Ah! Oh god, never mind. Ow. Let's finish this. My heart is beating out of my chest from the adrenaline. Holy crap. It's gonna blow! <laughs> Broke your nose. Holy crap, what is that? Centipede? I guess we're going to finish this right here and now. Ah, oh, I couldn't get maximum I accidentally to start. How about now, Kitty? Still not enough, you say. You can go another round, can't you? Your soul causes all us. The Lumen Sage.
Jeez. That was creepy. Now, where are my new best friends? I suppose one of them is an adult, so they should be okay. She just amazes me. Every single time I play. Every single time. <laughs> hey, I got a silver. Not bad. I'll take it. I will take that. Right, I felt like those chapters were quite quick, so we're going to keep going. Right, so now we're on chapter 12. The Broken Sky. Excuse me, sir. May I have my glasses back? Huh? Oh, she's so sweet. Yeah. And so well-mannered. Cereza, how did you get such magical glasses? <laughs> the glasses aren't magic, silly. I can see the monsters without them. Monsters? Not quite. So, uh, has Bayonetta, I mean your mom, been fighting these big bad monsters for a long time? Mummy is a witch, and witches protect people and are very strong. When I grow up, I'll be strong too, and I'll protect my mummy. Oh. You think witches do what? No, oh, forget it. No point in arguing with a little kid. I'll manage on my own. I'm sure you will. <laughs> Spooked! Mummy! Shit. You never cease to amuse me, Cheshire. I suppose that's your next target. Oh yeah! Bayo calls him Cheshire. Just like how the little one shies, I calls her little kitty cat Cheshire. This is yours, little one. You didn't cry while I was gone, did you? Nope. Good. Bayonetta. No matter how I ask, no matter how many times. You always say the same thing. Come now, Kitty. You know it was a all misunderstanding. Just... You're so stubborn, you know that? My father. He was a journalist, too. In fact, he was twice the man I could ever hope to be. He was obsessed with one case his entire career. A case so bizarre it took over his life. They could have made a movie of the details. The followers of darkness, the Umbra witches, and their light world counterparts, the Lumen Sages, controlling everything with a power known as the Eyes of the World. Then, the light and dark clans suddenly disappeared from their medieval home in Europe. You may be familiar with the town. You're standing in it. Welcome to Vigrid. 500 years later. 500 years. Damn. No wonder she can barely remember. That was a long ass time ago. Working at the behest of the powers that be, sought to lead their fractured world towards peace. They both possessed an eye said to have the power to create history that they used to oversee the world. However, their spirit of cooperation did not last. For amongst them, a pair of young star-crossed lovers conceived a child that sent the clans on a path to ruin. The woman was thrown in jail, and the man exiled from his clan. However, the child remained with the Umbra, raised as a black sheep even amongst the darkness. Since the balance between light and dark had been lost, both clans spiraled into decay. Legend had it that the two eyes could be united to control reality itself. And this legend fueled ambition and desire, leading to a myriad of battles between the clans. In fact, it led to their mutual destruction. My father was mocked for buying such a fairy tale. However, I believed his story. And I believe it more than ever now that I've found you. The memory of the clan lingers on, despite the passing of 500 years. What on earth was my father searching for? And why did he have to die for it? I 
have to discover the truth with my own eyes. That's why I haven't given up my chase for it. Or you. Yeah, I don't think it was... The head of the Ithavar, I don't think she's the one that killed that his father. Recently tried to sell an enormous gemstone on the black market. If he isn't selling out in the open, it means we're going to have to acquire it by other means. And that starts by sneaking onto that jet. He's definitely the narrator for the Genshin Impact trailers. Oh, so cute. <laughs> it's mini Bayonetta. Honey? Are you looking for something? I am. How did you lose it? Little one. Do you have anything you really like? Something really important to you? Yes, this. I love it. Wow. Where did you get this? You gave it to me, Mummy, for my birthday. Oh. When you love something, never lose it. Understand, little one? You must keep it safe, close to your heart. Now what? That's a car. Nice. Teresa. Damn. Bro. You had one job. Ow, where's... Where's the baby? Shit. Well, bollocks, did I come out of the ground? What the f... Alright. Guess we're doing this. Military transport Valkyrie! What the hell? What the hell? Okay. Looks like we have to dodge that. Unfittingly for a city its small size of its small size, Vigard plays host to a large military airbase. The roar of takeoff and landing that engulf the city are not that of passengers passenger planes, but of incredible incredibly large military transport jets known as Valkyries. I have been aboard American military transports many times in uh, in an official capacity and have seen many of the finest jets up close. However, none compares to even a distant view of Valkyrie... Of, of, of a... Can't read! Of a Valkyrie, the size difference is clearly evident. Like, uh, the difference in, is... In, in size between a crow and eagle. Uh, to think that something that large could fly in the sky is something that I can still... I still cannot believe, despite having seen it with my own eyes. 
Of course, there is no doubt that the cargo it carries is quite dangerous, so seeing the plane's huge mass literally drop onto the runway during landings causes me to feel a deep anxiety, as if the weight of the plane were literally landing on my shoulders. It leads one to wonder what the authorities are bringing into this little principal principality with all the extreme security that they have in place. Brigard has long since cut most ties with the outside world and has reared itself within its own unique culture. Perhaps it is the influence that led to the Valkyrie's equally unique design. At a glance, one can see the deep religious influence in this in its design, or perhaps that view is simply our difference to a plane born of technology, so different from our own that we simply nod our heads in astonishment at the miracle of flight. I think whoever invented the airplane or thought of the idea was an absolute madman. I think a lot of people died in the manufacturing of the airplane. You know, the trial and testing crew. Okay, now we're falling from the sky. Jump! 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 We're back. Okay. Got them. And you're dead. Got him. Right. The book is what I wanted. Some more lore. At the center of the man made island of Isla del Sol, there is a display of sheer military force, unimaginable for the likes of Vigrid. A display whose menacing power even I cannot shake. While there is very little public face to these efforts, if my information is correct, the military spending here rivals that of even the great powers in the world. Moreover, amongst the towers of enterprise and government, other buildings stand as anti-aircraft countermeasures. These buildings, a strategic defense initiative known as the Gjallarhorns, Gjallarhorns, or Gjallarhorns, are equipped with a battery of anti-aircraft SAM missiles and have been placed in four corners of the island. What in the world would cause a small place like this to install such dramatic defenses? There's also word that the Americans are involved in the armament and expansion of the military complex here. It is said that the Itaval group is undertaking some sort of next generation energy research and thus has traded rights to this technology for added force of arms. It is not a wholly unbelievable story. Seeing all of this military takeoffs and landings here in Vigrid, I don't want to think their destination is actually the place I call home. Okay. We're going through there. Out. I can't get through there. Okay, I'm, I'm not going through there. 
Elf, are we? What? Oh, hey. Long time. Why so glum? Something troubling you? Only your constant fretting over my state of affairs. I've no time to play games with you. No need to take out your stress on me, Bayonetta. It's clear you're worried for the girl. Oh, this music is new. I love it when these two fight. Oh my god. Whoa. Tell me where she is. That was now. sick. My, aren't we attached to our precious little one? Do you like it when she calls you mummy? You're absolutely delusional. If I leave her, he'll never shut up about it. And his whining is twice as irritating as anything the child could muster. <laughs> You've quite the tongue when it comes to curling round the truth. And what about you? What are you hiding? Oh? Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think these might mean something to you. <gasps> I've no need for worthless junk. Okay. Wait. What is that? I am well aware of my task, but you have forgotten that I do not need your help. <laughs> Oh, crap. It seems your little friend is gone forever. Whoa. What? How did she do that with rainwater? Fill them. Fill your eyes with hatred. Accept your violent fate. Accept it. And earn the left eye. Prove you deserve it. <laughs> Who is that voice? It keeps speaking out to Bayonetta like... Are we going again? Look at these two go, man. It's incredible. Whoa. Damn, she's strong. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Oh, my oh God, I'm nearly dead. Okay. Oh my god. Oh 
Whoa! Okay. Everybody relax. Everybody chill. We're good. Oh, next stage. Stage two. Motorbike. Hey, you're not going to run away from me again, are you? Okay, no, you're going to run towards me with your motorbike. Let's go. Oh my God, bro. She won. Oh my god, I can't believe I had another one of those. That was a tough fight, and I used every potion and every item I had in my inventory. But I don't care, because I won. Not yet. She isn't ready. What do you mean by that? Okay, I need to stock up on some stuff. Let's go. Another book! I'll read that one later. I want to get through this level. Ah! Oh my god. What is happening? There she is. Mummy! 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 Teresa! Mummy! I'm so scared! No crying now, little one. You know the rules. No cockroaches or crying babies. How are we gonna get out of this? Hold on tight, okay? How? Oh my god, I've got the baby. I, I've got I've got the baby. I am Okay, put down the baby. My little baby, we're going. Done. Finished. I'll take this. Now let me get the baby. Let me get the baby. Come on, Sariza. I got you. A Sariza. I say Sariza.
Put the baby down. Or not. Or put the baby down. Yes. Ha! What is happening here? What is... What happened there? Where am I supposed to go, bro? We're dying down here. No! Baby's dying! Oh my god, thank god. Okay, that, that, that part was a little bit confusing, but we got there. All right, we made it through that chapter. Not great now. Definitely not a good trophy. Yeah, that's... That sounds about right. Pow, 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 pow. Pow! 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 Yeah! Not bad! 72 points! Let's see if we can get one of these. Wow, so now we're on chapter 13. Oh yeah, the baby. Sreza. Let's go. <laughs> the way she passed her to him. I'll be right back. All right, we're going straight into the combat, it seems. Wait. Are we jumping straight into another boss fight? Why is it every time I boot up this game, I jump into a boss fight? What is that? Auditio Sapientia? I can't pronounce any of these words. It's like a shark or something. Oh. <laughs> nice shot. Uh, another talkative type. I don't think I've got time to entertain your blather. I'd much rather hear it straight from your boss. <laughs> The witch hunts. Rest, I think. Oh, he's got faces on his legs. The new era of creation? Oh, we surfing. Oh, we're... Oh, we, we surfing. Oh, okay. How... how right, how we... Oh, we can do flips! Oh my god, we can do flips! Okay, aim for the faces. I'm assuming that's what we have to do. 
Which lane, baby? Nice, got one. Watch out. Oh my god, look at the flips. Bro, this is awesome. <laughs> this game is so goddamn entertaining. Oh, oh, not gonna get me. I'm too fast for this shit. This game is just incredible, dude. <laughs> oh my god, he's a shark. The Megadon, I knew you were real. I knew you weren't a myth. Oh shit, okay. All right, here we go. There we go. That combo seems to work quite good. Which time, baby? Let's go. Oh, God. Oh. Don't. No. Oh. Bro. Did you see that? That's skill, though, right? Here comes the Fain. Oh, this is my favorite boss fight so far, I think. I'm having so much fun. You ready? Is everybody ready? Yes! Let's go! One more. Yes! Oh, what's she gonna do now? Whoa! Oh my god, we summoned our own beast. Is that a tarantula? What? Is he running away? Oh, okay. Oh, oh, all right. What is happening? Oh. <laughs> Wait, does he got new faces now? Here we go again. Let's do it. All right, so we need to steer him. This way. I got him, I got him, I got him. This is it, this is it, this is it. Yes! Come on, Tarantula! Oh! Took a chunk out of him. Oh. Oh, oh we, now we got the actual face here. Okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, where's he? Oh, shit. Got it, got it, easy. Got it, easy, easy. Watch him go, watch him go. We good. We got this. Okay. Oh, he got me. He got me. He got me. He got me. Down. Oh, got it. Got it. Got it. Only does two anyway. This is such a cool boss fight, dude. Honestly. It's so fun. You don't have to take this fight too seriously either, which is great. Oh, here we go. Let's go. That's my queen right there. Oh, this way, this way, this way. Ah, get down. Come on, of it. There we go. Take another chunk out of him. Yes! Yes! Get the Final Fantasy update. Oh, yes. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is new. Well, what is happening? Whoa! Are we supposed to do this? Holy crap! Oh, we shoot? Oh, we actually meant to head down towards him?
Are we good? Yeah, we're meant to head down towards him. Uh oh. Shit. Oh, nice! Gotta give him that. Oh! Shit! Yes, we got him! This is it! It's over, baby! Oh my god. Oh! Thirsty! I'm thirsty all of a sudden. Eat him! Holy crap! Spider web? What? Oh. Yes! Forget what I said earlier about this game getting excessively no more difficult. It just gets excessively better Much as I that. play it. It's incredible. Okay, whatever you say. Welcome aboard, Cheshire. Oh, fucking hell! <laughs> <laughs> hey, come on now. Mommy! Don't be using them words around I the kids. I told you I'd be right back. <laughs> Shouldn't you be, you know, flying this thing? I'm a bit occupied at the moment. Mommy! Mommy! <laughs> Come on, Cheshire. Well, so much for the subtle approach. We might as well have speakers on this thing blaring right of the fucking Valkyries. <laughs> Come now, we're VIPs. You know, nothing says you've made it in life like a private helicopter. <laughs> then welcome aboard Air Luca, flight 001. This is your captain, Luca, speaking. Fasten your safety belts, as this may be a bumpy flight. Whoa, we're heading to the city. That was, that's, as I said, that was my favorite boss fight that I've done so far. Admittedly, there was a couple of boss fights that were... I got a silver <laughs> award. Um, that were, like, a little bit more difficult and... I guess it's kind of difficult to understand it at first, but when you get used to them, they're actually really, really good. But this was the most fun I've had doing a boss fight. We're jumping into chapter 14 now. Oh, we're actually going to Isla del Sol. You're really not going to like what comes next. I hope you know that. Don't tell me. Air Cheshire has awful in-flight entertainment and horrendous food. Think about it. Those things that downed the jet aren't just going to let us land on their island. You think we can just say, hey, we're here, and they'll bring us a cake? Things look good from up here. But the further down you go, the harder it is to not notice the reality. Whoa. Cheshire, look. Oh, he's looking. He's looking. Oh, look. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, missiles. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> oh, wow. Whoa, how did that happen? Welcome to my fantasy zone. Get ready. 
What? What? Okay, hang on. We can fire guns and missiles. Expends one magic gauge. Okay. And L2 and R2 to evade. Okay, I got it. Oh, that's trippy. <laughs> Okay. Got him. This is cool. Ah! Got him. Ah! I don't see them coming. Dude, this is nuts. This is so cool. Uh oh, what's that mean? Uh oh. Oh, okay. We got these guys now. Nice. Okay, we get witch time when we dodge. I think we got him. Nice. We're doing good now. Oh my god, I'm gonna get freaking motion sickness from this. <laughs> no, 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 no. Uh oh Here we go again. Oh shit! Oh god, <laughs> I'm getting dizzy, bro. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god. Just keeps firing. Got him! Holy crap. Okay, we did it. I think. Oh, it's not over. It's not over. I was gonna take a celebrity drink there, but... Whoa, this is such a cool mission. Dude, these two chapters are so fun. This is difficult enough. It's going on. Oh my god, another boss fight. Oh shit, I didn't get it. Oh 
Oh my god! This is nuts, dude! Damn it, I have no missiles. Come on, we got it. Oh my god, it never ends! <laughs> I'm so sorry if you guys are sensitive to motion sickness. Because this is crazy. Got him! Yes! Finally! Is that it? Please tell me that's it. I don't know if I can take any more spinny spins. It's brilliant, Mummy. We made it, finally. That city felt like forever away. Oh my god, does she ever quit? How many times are we gonna fight? Oh, is that how it's pronounced? Isla del Sol is what I was pronouncing as. Power. John, if you've made it this far, that should be enough. You're back to your old self. This is where we finish what was started so long ago. What? With rockets? A friend of my enemy is also my enemy. Be it witch or sage. The Lumen Sages. They were our counterbalance as overseers. Between us, there was a law that was never to be broken. It stated that the intersection of light and dark would bring calamity to this earth. But 500 years ago, a child was born, in clear violation of this tenet. That child... was you. Five hundred years ago. The disaster this caused sent the clans into a spiral of chaos... ...that continues to be felt to this day. You, the half-breed of light and dark, are at the center of that chaos. Allowing you to continue to exist is a danger that cannot be accepted. Okay, I... When the eyes of the world are within our grasp, the power of creation will be awakened. That is why the left eye, our treasured left eye, will never fall into the hands of another! The left eye, our treasured left eye, will never fall into the hands of another. Bayonetta, it is time that this is brought to an end. That you are brought to an end. You... You did it. It is our charge as witches to protect the treasures of the clan by any means necessary, even if it means burning every inch of this island to a crisp. Excuse me? Who? Luca! I'm really beginning to hate missiles. Man you know, of many vehicles. I have no idea what the hell you girls got going on here. But you don't mind if I take this off your hands, do you? Get in, Cinecita. Mommy. <laughs> Mommy! 
Don't even think about it. What the? F no way. Theresa. Bayonetta. Time is of the essence. This can wait no longer. Yeah, you're right. You're going down. Holy crap! Okay. I should have went to the gates of hell. Because I am... Okay, I got red hot shot. I'm gonna need a few red hot shots, but this is intense. Oh! Oh yes, I won. Come on. Whoa, what the freak? She got a tarantula. What's happening? What's going on? Holy fuck, the building collapsed. Oh, oh. Oh, where's, where, where's she close? Excuse me? You rip off Bayonetta! Hey. Those are my clothes! Holy crap! Whoa! Whoa! There you go. Right back at you! I said right back at you! Oh god, I said right back at you! Ugh. Yeah! Oh. Here we go. Yeah, in your face. Oh shit. Oh, I got another one. Okay, that came in clutch. This fight is incredible. <laughs> uh oh, oh, oh god. Jesus! I wasn't ready, but I was at the same time. Cause I'm awesome. She is destroying me. Wait, I'm curious. Did you guys struggle against her as well? First fight, or I'm just need more practice. Holy shit. This fight is incredible. The straw on her. Oh my god. Oh yes, I win again. Oh my god. Oh. Oh. No. Are you serious? Oh. Oh my god, I got to the same part and I died again. Shit. Okay. This is gonna take... This is gonna take some, uh... Some time, I think. Gonna take a drink. Take a breather. <sighs> Let's go again. Okay. Oh god! Are you fucking serious?
Are you fucking serious? I want to scratch my goddamn stupid ass nose. Go, bitch. I know you now. Uh. Oh. Let's go! Oh, let's go! Let's go! incredible oh my god once you figure out her patterns it's so rewarding oh my god best i take it back this is my favorite boss fight holy shit i'm full of adrenaline right now <laughs> wow wow fear is still not gone from your eyes fear the memories You've held for five hundred yes. years. The God, I felt so good. Fear. They cloud your vision. <sighs> but now you've accepted your fate. That is how you bested me. That is why you possess the most beloved of Umbran treasures. That is why you possess the left eye. We fought for this stone, and because of it, everyone died. That gem brings back so many memories. What the hell? Do not fear your fate. Stand, Teresa. What? In the innocence of our childhood. We used to play together as friends. But as time passed, perhaps even my eyes were clouded with fear. We were. Do not fear your fate. Stand, Ceresa. Stand and open your eyes. For with every truth, there is another one to be seen. What the shit? I thought she was dying.
What the fuck? Ow! Jean! Jean. Luca, was that you? Oh, sorry, I thought you blew up. Hey. Is it over? What? It's not like you don't scare the shit out of me all the time. Cereza. I don't know whether to shoot you or to take you to Vegas for good luck, Cheshire. Give me more credit than that. If you must know where L-U-K-A Luca is concerned, there's no such thing as luck. Only skill. Mm -hmm. I'm assuming it was pure luck. <laughs> okay. Skill was involved. I, looks like it was jumping to death, but okay. I mean, witches, did you, Bayonetta? How's the little one? Out like a light. But okay other than that. What about you? You really think I'm gonna let myself be seen in public with a girl looking all beat up like that? Oh. Lollipop. <laughs> I look dreadful, do I? Huh? You'll have to learn to wipe that stupid look off your face, or I'll never let you keep chasing me around this world. Got that? Luca? <laughs> now that's more like it. Oh my god. That was amazing. Chapter 14 complete. <laughs> oh, what a day. Now that was only because of the amount of continues I use. I think if I went back and done that. I could probably do it first try and get a better trophy than that. But hey, that was amazing. Because as you remember, in the previous episode, we have we had defeated John. And um Welcome back, little one. We've reunited with Luca. And Sarasa. It looks like someone's expecting us. Awfully nice of them to roll out the red carpet. Luca, you need to get one thing straight. Yeah, I know. I won't look after you, so don't screw up. I love how I she's calling him Luca you. now as well, by the way. Let's go. Stay next to me, little one. We're not Cheshire. I, I, Daddy? What? Daddy, it's Daddy. Wait, wait, wait. Of course, Mommy. Can't you hear him? Okay, Daddy, I'm coming. And don't bring Mommy with me. Wait. Little one, wait. This way, Mommy. Little one. No, Cereza. It's a trap. It has to be. Daddy? Who the f is Daddy? Cerecita! Bayonetta! Damn it! It's a wall building. Hey! What? I don't trust them things. Oh, yes! Oh, yes. Oh, 
I want to master this. I want to master the gameplay in the Bayonetta games by the end of my playthroughs. Like, I know it doesn't seem like it, but it's been a while since I've played a game like this. Devil May Cry 5 was the last game that I played that was hack and slash style gameplay. I'm, I'm usually quite good at games like this. It's just been a long time since I've played them and actually, you know, spend time learning combos and the timing of dodging and stuff like that. But I think, I think when we get to Bayonetta 2, and especially when Bayonetta 3 comes out, we're, we're going to master the way this game works. Come at me, bro. Come on. Oh, okay. Uh, he was kind of dazed there, so. Alright, let's use the sword. This is pretty powerful angel weapon, so. Whoa. What the hell? A huge industrial machine is visible. What is that? It seems to be a set of something via automation, but it's not operating at the moment. Whoa! Nice. Oh, there's another one. And there's two more. Okay. Pick this up. Oh shit. Let's go. Got him. I'm curious as well. Let me know down below in the comment section. What's your preferred weapon use in this game? Like what way would you like to what way do you prefer to organize your weapons? I kind of like what I've got going on here with these. I think these are actually pretty cool, but at the same time, I'm like, maybe I'm missing out on some other weapons that I should have been using, but I've gotten too used to... Oh, shit. Okay, so they do come alive. Oh, I hate these dudes. They're so difficult to fight. Oh my god, they're actually kicking my ass as well. Whoa! Wait, where'd they go? Oh, it's because the door closed? Uh oh. Oh my god, okay. I knew this was gonna get really hard. Holy shit. No! Here we go. Get up on the pony. Come on. There you go. Better? Nice. Didn't do too bad there. Oh, we got a platinum and all. It's nice. Oh, man. They've got them flames around them. Which makes this extremely difficult. Damn it, dude. And around you go. Okay, we got him. Oh, shit. More. Oh, my God. These guys are back. Oh, 
Come on, then. Let's do this. Got it. Maximum power. Crush it. Sweet. All right, we're getting there. We're getting there. We're fighting every sort of angel that we fought in the past. And it's... Uh, <laughs> this is fair enough to be challenging. I'm not going to lie. And I feel like I don't play this game enough to be... Oh, my God. This guy's back. Oh, my God. I was going to say I don't play this enough to actually get good at it. Oh, oh, okay. Let's go through the walls. Come on. Rear your ugly head. All right, we good? Sweet. I'll take this. Thank you. Oh, looks like we do have to... Oh, no, we don't. I was going to say, it looks like we have to fight the big dude, but... Looks like we don't. Oh, okay, maybe we do. All right. Yep, we do. We have to, we have to fight him. Wait a minute. Cannons? Stop. No way. Can I use these? Yo! Switch over. Oh god, I'm nearly dead. Okay, hang on a minute. I I can I got I got something. Ah! Damn it, there's too many! Oh. Whoa! Oh my god, that took all my health! What the fuck? Oh my god, dude. I am so dead. Dead. Oh no, yeah, I forgot I got um, one of those. Alright, we're not too bad, we're not too bad. Uh oh. Oh! No, my god! Oh my god, dude. Why are you an asshole? Oh god! I'm nearly dead! I'm nearly dead! Oh my god, it never stops, does it? Oh, I'm dead! I'm dead! God damn it! Yes! Oh, that's what we do, we keep firing. So we... we got it, we got it. We got this. We... Ah, it's alright, I got a revive, it's fine. Just gotta keep shooting. Just gotta keep shooting. We good, we good. We good, we good. We good. In the face, 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 in the face. We took that one on the chin. Yes! You asshole! Take that! Take that! Let's do this. Ooh, what is this? I take. They've simply blocked off areas that are, aren't currently in use. Doesn't feel like Sarisa is here either. Oh, I thought there was actually something there. That's fine. <laughs> Alright. We broke the gate. Uh-oh. Oh, now what? <gasps> the full moon. Oh, God. Oh, God. Uh well, fuck it anyway. Ah! I got no health left. What the shit was I supposed to do there? Oh! Well, I'm dead now. God damn it! Oh! Okay. We can actually run up here. Oh, okay. I knew it wasn't going to be that easy. Um. Whoa. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. It's fine. Ah, you stupid.
Ow! Oh my god, I'm getting my ass kicked here. Oh my god. Oh, I need to gain some health. Oh! I'm so dead. Ah! Oh my god, dude. This is such a hard level. Oh my god! Piss off! Dude, this fight's annoying! This fight's annoying me! This fight is annoying me! I'm dead! I'm so fucking dead! Oh my god, give me witch time! Come on, I need something! I'm so dead! Ah! This fight is awful! Knockout, come on. Oh, yes. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. Oh! It's fine. It's fine. Come on! Let's finish this! Come on, Bayonetta! Come on, my queen! Slice! It's over, you piece of shit! Grrr. Jump down here. Sweet. Okay. Now what? The heck are we now? There's no telling when the building will be destroyed. I have to find Sarisa quickly and get her out of here. Boob. Oh, thank God. I need to get some stuff. All right, I'm just going to get some health items because I need them. I hate the way I can only have three as well. I'm going to need one of these as well. Now I'm ready to roll. Oh, what's this? Platform? Oh. Okay. How are you? Whoa, what the hell is all of this? What? Dude, what the heck? Platforms, cool. Oh! Oh! Great. I fell. Okay. Wait. Wait. What? Oh god. Oh god! Ah, god! Uh oh. Okay. I feel like an... There, I got across. Is this where we're supposed to go? What the hell? This is so confusing. I see a book. Oh, come on! No, bro! What the fuck? What the hell, dude? No! Oh my god. This is really irritating. What the fuck? Wait, what the shit? Really?
Oh my god. Dude. I knew this was going to get super hard. Oh my god. Ah! Shit. Okay. Technically died there. Nearly over. This is it. This is it. Come on, girl. Finish it. Yes. Some some volleyball, anyone? Beat the crap over. Come on, beat you. Knock out. It's over. Thank you. Oh, okay. Okay, we finally, we're finally getting places. God, that was weird and difficult and confusing, man. Oh. What the f Not this thing again? Okay, we're not in the water this time, though. your face whoa shit Fata Fata fatality oh god oh not fast enough I'm in the flames how am I not dead right now oh my god my ass is on fire get me out of here oh shit whoa what the hell? Whoa, what is this? Is this a giant ball of flames? Whoa, what is... Is that space? Am I in space, bro? Uh oh. What? What even is this? This is insane. <laughs> this is so oh my god, look at the view. Holy shit. That is so cool. Okay, let's go over here. What are we supposed to do with this? Huh. Okay. Oh, we did it! Alright, we passed that chapter. Oh my god, dude. Yeah, no, that was a terrible... Definitely gonna be... Yeah, stone. Oh, what a day. I got a stone award. Chapter 16, The Lumen Sage. <gasps> what follows those living in the light is nothing but the oh. profound. 
Empty darkness, born from the shadow that grows longer as they approach the brilliant radiance. This is the guy that has been talking to, to us. See, your eyes must be open to both light and dark. Don't you agree, my dear child? Well, lipstick on the baby fur. Little one. You've arrived. My dear, sweet Cereza. My, my. Why the grim face, my dear? As a child, your Wait. smile was warmer than the sun. Wait, what? So, you are the last of the Lumen Sages. Why is he calling me Cereza? I am indeed. Don't tell me like... My name is Balder, but if you so choose, you may address me as Father. Wait. There is much you have forgotten. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It has been 500 years since we last met. I'm so confused. Is Cereza me? were still intact, this would have been a much more emotional reconciliation. So is Cereza a memory? How did you get the girl? I'm so confused right now. I knew we looked alike, but I just thought maybe because she's my daughter. That's what we look like, right? We, the Lumen Sages, and your Umbra Witches, have long been the overseers of history, each bearing witness with their own eye. This is how our Universes Existence was preserved. However, for five hundred years, you have been exiled from the world's affairs. You are the left eye of the eyes of the world. Could you dispense with the riddles and just tell me what these sodding eyes actually are? Your years of slumber have caused you to forget many things, even as we stand on the verge of the resurrection of the Creator. The resurrection of Jubileus. There is but one way to return your epic of forgotten memories and open your eye of the overseer. Your uncorrupted eye had to be exposed to the history it could not see. Ah. Your battles, your struggles, everything you've experienced in this town has been a stepping stone for your enlightenment. That peacock alive or dead? It has all been done for the left eye. I've had enough of your philosophical pretensions. I won't ask again. Where did you get the girl? <laughs> your question has been answered. All this has been done to awaken the left eye. For that... You had to see yourself once more. You are truly beyond salvation, Sage. Ah, salvation. Such a curious word. I mark the path to salvation with light. However, no matter how brilliant that light grows, the darkness within the human heart grows even darker. Light, dark, and chaos between. Three realities, once split, shall be brought together to create a new universe in the image of the old. To these ends, leading to the Festival of Resurrection 500 years ago, I fanned the flames of terror, spurring on the witch hunt. However, despite the people's belief in the return of Jubileus, the Creator, 
the left eye was out of reach. Since then, I have devoted myself to this town's prosperity, and now it is time for my preparations to bear fruit. Jubileus will be resurrected. We will become the eyes of the world, and a new universe will take us. I could never call the man behind this nightmare father. Luca. Uh, great speech, big guy. You there this whole time? Luca. Getting a bit ahead of ourselves, aren't we, Mr. Big Shot Ithaval Executive? Salvation, light. You take this entrepreneurial philosophy a bit seriously, don't you? But it's all diarrhea of the mouth, if you ask me. History is littered with famous genocidal figures just like you. Or, should I say, infamous genocidal figures. You must be Luca, journalist extraordinaire. I must say, I'm truly impressed you've made it this far, child. Like father, like son, I suppose. What? Luca, Luca, Luca. Your father had problems with my philosophies. It's fine to investigate. But when malicious rumors start to spread, I must see to it that they come to a stop. For being kind enough to ascertain that my long lost razor was at the bottom of some lake, I granted him his final wish and accepted his permanent resignation. You bastard! Uh oh. Whoa! See, now he knows. You are of no use to me. However, I am not without dignity. I will allow you to die in the same manner as your father. <laughs> oh! Oh my god. Thank god. That was close. Oh! Shit. Luca! Luca! Well, I guess my plan has gone right out the window. <laughs> Such a shame that sacrifice had to be made. But if destiny is not fulfilled soon, this tragedy will be repeated ad nauseum. <laughs> Speaking of tragedy, I suppose you've met Jean. While she sealed you away and kept you from trouble, after falling into our hands, she's been incredibly useful. Although her distinct lack of obedience required a bit of mental reprogramming. So it was him. Tragic end led you directly to me. He's the one that's corrupted John. He's the, the one that killed Luca's father. The left eye is soon. Fear not, my dear sweet Cereza. Oh, I, I expected as much. Holy crap. Whoa. Do not fear your fate. Stand tall, my child. Realize your true potential. Bro. Sereza, we are one, my child. <laughs> 
What are you doing with the baby? What the fuck? What the hell just happened? What the little baby? What is this? Okay, that's fucked up. That's fucking weird. The Lumen Sage, Father Boulder. Oh, okay, I guess. Hey! Oh, you ass, wait. Ah. Okay, this is about timing. Okay, this is like the, the John fight. I have to... Oh my god! Come on! Oh, oh. Oh my god, my timing is all over the place. Uh, oh. Satellite dish? What the shit? Oh man. Health potion. Oh my god. Okay. Oh shit. What's the catch with the one health bar? There is so much more to this fight, isn't there? Oh shit. There you go. In your face. Oh, let's go, baby. Eat him. Yes. Max bonus. Ah. Oh, shit. What? What the hell? No! What the fuck? Okay, yep. I, I knew there was a catch. Because now he's got full health again. Wait, you gonna chuck a building at me? Yep, you're gonna chuck a building at me. Yeah. All right. Oh, oh, bollocks. I was not expecting that. I thought I had to dodge. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, God. Okay, I thought he was gonna chuck another building at me. We're good. Shoot, 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 shoot. Oh, my God. Okay. Okay. I'm, tr I'm trying it. He's got a freaking shield, bro.
Oh my god. Oh god, not this thing. Alright, here we go again. Punch him in the face. Here we go again. Let's go, baby. That's my girl. See how you fare against my centipede. Let's go. <laughs> oh, what? Maximum power! Damn it! <sighs> Shit! <sighs> it's... Now what? That's a comb? That's that's not a comb, that's, uh. that's a feather. Shit, satellite again? Okay. Wait, you're gonna bring the whole freaking thing down on me? Right back at you, bitch! Oh, Jesus! <laughs> and again! Yeah! Yeah! Let's go! This game is so hype! Oh, oh. Oh. Yeah. Come on. Time to finish this shit. Oh. Oh, I'm supposed to control this. Oh, damn, this is sick. Ah. Okay. Right in the forehead, right in the forehead. Yes! Jubilees, the creator, grace you. Oh my God, dude, that was so badass. <laughs> yes! Oh no! Controller! Oh, Luca! Luca's still alive! I don't know how, but he is. And we got. Cereza back? I've got to give you credit, Bayonetta. You never cease to impress. You haven't seen the half of it. I've seen enough. Well, that about wraps it up, huh? It's not over yet though, right? Not yet. What's next? A 
memory. Hmm. No. Her bedroom. Mommy. Daddy. No need to be afraid, little one. The nightmare is over. Everything was just a dream. You're a strong little girl. There is nothing you cannot overcome. Mommy. Did you find it? What you were looking for? Yes. I found it. So don't you worry anymore. You just keep your treasure safe too. Sweet dreams, little one. Fly me to the moon and let me play among the stars. Let me see what spring is like on Jupiter and Mars. In other words, hold my hand. In other words. I don't understand though. Is Cereza Bayonetta? Are they the same person? Was that a different timeline? Whoa. What is happening? Uh oh. Okay, Jean. When you love something, never lose it. Understand, little one? You must keep it safe, close to your heart. I'm not afraid anymore, Mummy. No matter what, there's nothing I cannot do. Bayonetta! What's happening to you? Oh, Luca, don't get too close. And now it is done. Wait, this cop shite still alive? The right eye oversees the light. The left eye oversees the darkness. Two eyes to oversee the world. It was never the woman known as Bayonetta that I set my sights upon. It was you as a child, Cereza, that I saw. Right. For she was the one who saw the world through innocent eyes. And she was the one who could give rise to a new history. It was her energy that could awaken the left eye. This has all worked out splendidly. Let us begin, Cereza. The time is at hand. Now, the resurrection of Jubileus shall be completed. We are the eyes overseeing the world. We are the eyes overseeing a new era, a new reality, to which we will devote ourselves eternally. What? The Creator graced all of its creations. What the hell, dude? Oh, what a 
day. I really need to uh, redo some of these levels, man. <laughs> okay, so now where are we at? Chapter 17? Whoa, hang on. Are we leaving the map? Epilogue. Requiem. Oh my god. Okay, let's go to the gates of hell first. Let me just get some items. A couple of, a couple of these. And I'm going to need another one of these, because these are a lifesaver. And that'll do. John? Thank God. There's still time. Wait, John is still okay. She's alive. Oh my god, are we gonna be playing as John? I'm gonna lose my mind if we start playing as John. The left eye, our treasured left eye, will never fall into the hands of another. It is the pride of the Umbra witches. Oh my god, we're John! Okay, so how does this work? Okay. We can dodge. Let's go. This is sick. Okay. Oh my. We are we are riding a motorcycle on 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 the side of a rocket that's on its way to space. Are you Ajon? That is sick, and I am doing a terrible job. Let's go, John! Whoa! Okay, we are we are in space. Oh my god, we're actually playing as as John for real. Oh my god, dude, this is actually so cool! Same, same, um... Same controls and everything, same kind of moveset, so... Oh, this is awesome! I was not expecting this at all, this actually makes me so happy. You've provided me with many blessings. The one and only authentic left eye. Merely seeing it must stir jealousy within you. Your body must yearn to feel a new universe form around it. I have no intentions of gazing upon the left eye. I am here to reclaim my Umbran sister. <clears throat> Whoa, we just blew up a freaking planet! Uh oh.
We're good, we're good. We got this under control. It's all good. Whoa. This is so badass. The time has come for Jubileus to return. At last, the trinity of realities will know their real ruler, and time will begin anew. Theresa, <sighs> wake up! Are you insane? Light and dark! Unless both eyes remain, the universe will lose its balance and face another Armageddon! Oh no! Then this thing should have slept for eternity! Now you must wake up, Cereza. Oh my god, Jean! Cereza! Cereza! Damn you! Open your eyes! I mean, may I suggest CPR? Oh, never mind, she's awake. She's awake! Theresa, you aren't the person I sealed away 500 years ago. You have the strength to overcome this and fight. Finish this. Uh oh, what's going on? Uh oh, oh no, Jean. Jean, Jean, Jean! No, Jean! No, Jean is just floating in space. Oh, do we only get to play as her for a short period of time? Damn, I should have made the best of it. My, oh my. No one can control Jubileus now. His power is too intense. Light, dark, human. All the strife. All the struggle. The trinity of realities. Wrapped. Up in a vortex of oh my god. Whoa! Is this Jubileus? The creator? Day. Jubileus. Wait, how do... Am I supposed to fight... Oh, hello. Am I supposed to fight that? I... I guess Rest, so. My friend. I'm off to get that black cat. Okay, right. So how... What's the game plan here? Ow. Ow. Okay. Is this a platform? I assume this is a platform that we can run on. Oh, no! Ah. Yeah, in your face! Ouch! Come on, then. Miss me. Ouch. Ah. Ah, yeah. Oh, God. Okay. We're good. We're fine. Everything's fine. We got it. Punch. Punch. Come on. Nearly have one health bar gone. Yeah! Take that! Oh dear, what are you gonna do now? Whoa! Whoa, 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 what? Okay, it's lava time. Ow. 
Ouch. Ouch, lava. Lava's not fun. We're okay. Ow. In your face, Jubileus! In your face! Uh-oh. Nice! This fight is so badass, I love it. Uh-oh. Okay, now we're in the icy world. Ice world! Ouch! I got squished it. It's all good. Oh god. I've, I've really been... Strengthen up. Alright, where are you transporting us now? Okay. Uh, in the sky, it seems. Okay. Okay, okay. Oh god. Okay, we're falling. We're falling and blasting back up, it seems. All good. Let's jump to that. And then jump to this, and then beat the shit out of this. Okay, and we're gonna jump. Yo! Okay, we're good. Uh, okay, let's uh, jump over here. And over here. Jump over here, and over here. Okay, we good. Okay, we good. Yes! Knocked him! Down you go. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. Let's do it. Ah! We're falling! It's fine. It's fine. Oh god, we're falling again! You just gotta believe. Just gotta believe! Oh god. Ah. Yes! Knocked him! Come on, Jubilees! Not much left, not much left. Come on, we can do this. I can do this. I think. Oh, here we go again. Whoa! Whoa, what the hell? Wait, what was that? Dude, we starting from here? What? Wait, what? Why am I... What is going on? Oh, not this shit! 
Wait, 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 what's happening? Did I actually get a checkpoint here or or what is happening? Oh no, I'm a baby again. Okay. No, 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 no. Out. No, no, no. Out. No, no, no. Ah! Oh, okay. Okay, we good. No! Wait, how do I avoid that? Oh my god, I'm dying over and over now. Oh, come on! You turned me into a little baby again! Oof. Ah! Okay. That's more like it. Wait, I can't... I can't get away from that! Ah, come on. Hey, come on, I was in the middle of... Okay, we dodged it. We got away from it. Oh shit, okay. Oh shit, no! Okay. I'm not sure what... Ow. I'm supposed to do here. No, 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 no. Okay, that's what we need to do. We need to turn into our Black Panther form and just run away. Oh god. Okay. Jesus! What the fuck? This is ridiculous! No, 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 no! No, 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 no! 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 Bollocks! No! Yes! Wait, I knocked her? Did I knock her? Now what? I need health. I need health. I need to last. I need to do this. I'm actually going to use this as well. I'm going to just use all my freaking power-ups. No! 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 Yes! Come on! Oh. No! You are not going to get me like that! No!
No! No! No! No! No! Yes! I don't know how he dodged all that, but he did it. Come on, bitch! Come on, bitch! Come on! Yes! Come on, baby! Let's do it! Oh, I have it! I have it, baby! I have it! Come on! Let's go! Let's go! Look at her go! Alright, is it square or circle? Which is it? Come on, finish it! Finish it! Is this the true Jubileus? Yes! I wanted to get the limit! Big bang bonus! Hang on. Oh no! I want to aim for the sun, not the planet. Oh! Damn it! I want to redo. <laughs> oh, I failed! Oh bollocks! Are you serious? My thought process was, oh, I want to make or hit every planet on the way down. Well, you're not actually supposed to hit any planets. Okay, we're aiming for the sun. This should be fairly simple. I'd like to think so, anyway. Probably not hit any rocks on the way, either. Okay, should be a straight shot from here, no? Nope! Never mind, there's loads of meteorites and shit. Whoa, that was close! Too close, too close! Okay. Nope, we're dodging this planet, too. And this planet, the Earth. This is this is kind of crazy. <laughs> oh God! Okay, that planet is bigger than I thought. Yo! Oh, that was close. Oh, we're just about there. Yes. Yes, melt, melt, bitch, melt. Hey, hey, got silver, that'll do. <gasps> Whoa. Oh my god, we did it. We freaking did it. Let's go. We beat Bayonetta! Yes! Oh my god, this game was so incredible, dude. Wait. What? Unbelievable. We managed to stop this abomination. She's it's okay. Still going to destroy the world. John! 
I love how they flash back to her and how she survived. Wait, <laughs> of course. <laughs> On my bike. I don't know what Come. a bike. You're one of a kind. Or how a bike would be useful in Who's space. But... Okay. I'll send you home, even if it kills me. Now, let's finish this. You and I are going home together. John, we're both one of a kind. Now those are the eyes I've been waiting to see. Uh-oh. Wait. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, all right. <laughs> this is so cool. I think this is just like the fun part. Where to next? Up here. We need to destroy this before it hits planet Earth. Yes. Nice, John. Nice. Let's go. Platinum medal. John! I'm okay. Let's go. Just stay close to me. We're falling. Is there anybody going to catch us? What? I thought it was over. How do you keep surviving all this? I bet you're trying to sneak up on me right now. Aren't you, Bayonetta? No, nope. not this time. Not this time. A few days later? Did we hit the ground? I am the way to eternal sorrow. I am the way well, to a forsaken. No rest for the wicked. But at least she's at peace. Back in the box she came from. And what? I guess I'm gonna have to find a new racket to line my pockets. No bonus for old Enzo this time. <laughs> As fucking usual. You know how it works with witches, Enzo. They make a deal with the devil. And when they die, the devil gets his due. You get set down in the hill and wandering around scared shitless for eternity. Kinda comes with the territory. Why are you telling me this? Is this not why we are standing here, praying for her soul to rest in peace? I better not be out here catching a fucking cold if these prayers don't mean nothing. It's nice to think your prayers are worth a damn, isn't it? You made a killing exploiting her. Hell, you never know. She might get lonely and come back to haunt your ass. I assume they're not talking about Bayonetta. <laughs> Haunt me? Hell can keep her then. Wait. Is this Luca? It's a lot of flowers. Isn't that? I said I'd never give up chasing you. I just never thought the chase would end like this. Wait, what? Rosemary, you said it was a demon repellent. It might help you on the road ahead. Hey, 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 wait a second. What the hell are they coming down here to get her for? Of course they'd come for the prize they've been seeking all along. Holy shit! You're... How did you not notice? 
She's right there. Here we go again. <laughs> yes. This looks ridiculous on me. Wait. I swear, this is the last John. time I cosplay. Oh my god, I'm so confused. <laughs> You fell asleep in that thing again. Hey, what the? You gotta fucking be kidding me. You're telling me she's. 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 She's fine. Fucking leave her. Yeah, there she is. She's only having a nap. Morning. What was shoving me into this filthy old car? Next time, some air holes would be nice. Fewer words, I hear. Save the chit chat for later. We've got work to do. It has a bit of rosemary. In the language of flowers, rosemary equates to remembrance. Suits me now, doesn't it? Let's dance, boys! Yes! Let's go, Hideki! Let's go! That was awesome. Everything about this experience was just... Perfect. I loved it. I love this game. This game is so badass, so sick. Amazing. Oh, we get to play the credits! We fighting John? Oh, okay. Oh, it's so cool! Wait, what? What happened? Oh, <laughs> I was enjoying that. Oh, okay. Yeah, I should have definitely used the sword more, I think. Yeah! An absolutely fantastic experience. I love it. Genuinely, I love it. It just brings back my um, my love for hack and slash games. It's reignited my passion for it. I just want to play this game all over again. <laughs> oh no, they wrecked the other car! That's brilliant. Took the two of them together. Well done, Platinum Games. Well fucking done. Alright, so... I mean, obviously... <laughs> this is not the best result. But... I think with... Well, when I replay... Hopefully soon... 
I'll make sure this changes. Wait, now what? Oh, we unlocked a little dance! Music is so good in this as well. Yeah! Let's go! Whoa, whoa, backup dancers? What? I like a concert. Okay. Girl can dance. Let's go. There's Luca. This is awesome. And John knows all. Oh, we still going? Yeah. Excuse me? Are you telling me the dance <laughs> was too much for my system to process? <laughs> what just happened? My PS5 overheated from that dance. Okay, something's... Okay, let's... All right. We we didn't lose any progress because I saved it, so it, it should be fine, but... Did, <laughs> what? All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. As you can see, my PlayStation couldn't take any more of that. We have did it. We've, we've done it. We've, we've beaten Bayonetta for the first time. An absolutely pleasant and amazing experience. I loved it. And I cannot wait for the second game. So we're going to be playing the second game, of course. We're going to continue to play through. And I hope all of you enjoyed it so far. Thank you so much for tuning in and watching all the videos. It's been an absolute blast. I cannot wait to start Bayonetta 2. If that gets you hyped and excited, please leave a like on the video and subscribe to turn on notification bells as well so you don't miss when that episode does drop but well, that's gonna be it lads we beat bayonetta for the very first time i'm so hyped and so happy 
and I hope you all enjoyed. Anyway, thank you so much for watching this Let's Play. I hope it was everything you wanted and more, and I hope you guys got nostalgic watching it. And I hope we get to excited for the third game. And congrats to all the winners of, as well of the giveaway prizes. You guys are awesome. Thanks for all the entries. More prizes to come. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, lads and ladies. And as always, stay geeky, stay cool, be awesome, and be happy. And I'll see you dudes in my next Bayonetta video. See you later, dudes.